with that. Yeah, comes, comes quick. quick. Uh, tonight we are playing, beginning playing, uh, the Tainted Grail campaign. My name's Joe. Uh, Matt. That's I'm Steve. Steve. <laughs> Josh. And, uh... We did, I feel like we have deja vu for some reason. It's almost like we recorded this and it didn't have sound or something like that. So, yeah. we're back! Yeah. Yeah. I want to read the little intro here of what's going on on the island of Avalon, where we are currently located in the story. This island was never meant for humans. Looming on the border between our reality and the ancient power known as the Weirdness, it was populated by a mysterious, legendary race. Humans came here anyway, as they always do. With their wooden ships, their ambitious king, and his fellowship of knights. <laughs> Never mind. They're running from a, pl a plague, ravaging their <laughs> distant little place. land. <laughs> yeah, it is. They took the island piece by piece, raising many years. That's that big statue. A forbidding shape and mysterious purpose. The former masters of the island faded into legend. 400 years later, not even their name remains. The people of Avalon called them the Four Dwellers. Times are harsh. The Red Death is back. The Miniers are dying, and without their power, the land itself crumbles back into the weirdness. That's why your hometown has gathered five of its strongest and wisest heroes and sent them to find help in distant Camelot. As these champions set out to brave the dangers of the wild land, you watch from afar. You are not one of them. We are just but weaklings. So we're just normal peeps hanging out in uh, Avalon, hoping to have a good time here. Um, I want to make sure we actually have audio real quick. Go ahead and, uh, if you want to introduce yourself, Matt. Yeah, 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 I'll go first. I am playing the character named Arath. Uh, he's a simple farmer with a not-so-simple past. Years ago, as a young mercenary, he helped raise many villages and shrines to the ground. Now, a mysterious curse follows him. Ooh. He is cursed, which means activating many years costs one more magic for him. I am <clears throat> alive. Um, an outcast whose entire family perished in the weirdness. She makes a modest living supplying healing herbs and roots to the locals. Um, I'm traumatized, so I can't reduce uh, terror unless I'm uh, resting where an active menher is. But I also have healing herbs. So I'm uh, healing herbs. Yeah, healing, healing herbs. herbs. Drugs. Watch out for Joe. Just heal your healing herbs. <laughs> I'm uh, Bayor, a local smith known for short temper. That's definitely me. And an incredible strength. Not really, but I'll, I'll take it. He does his best to conceal a festering, unhealed wound in his sides that he received under mysterious circumstances. Mm. Mm, yes. Uh, festering wound, I lose one health every time I become exhausted. So I don't want to use a lot of energy or I'm going to hurt myself. My character's name is Maggot, which reminds me of Nightmare and makes me want to play that now. But anyways, I am a renegade of the Druidic Order whose innate powers are curbed by his destructive addiction to mixtures and mushrooms used by the Druids. Here, Joggy. Yep. I am a recovering addict. Thank you very much. <laughs> uh, when dreaming, I toss a dial, and if it's a skull, I read the Nightmare instead. Which should be good, because we all need a nightmare every now and then. I'm a, I'm a little disappointed, actually. I looked at this, and I was like, it's the three of you. I was like, that's really cool. It's my point of view. I bet you yours is different. It's not. Nope, that's me right there, huh? Yep. So, um, Maybe you're the main character, Matt. Steve, would you like to read the event, the first event to us one more time? All right. <clears throat> all right. Ancient knowledge. The time is short. The guardian menher that has been protecting your town since the ancient days is about to go dark. Rumor has it that there's a Just secret druidic that. ritual that may help you rekindle the miniers. You must explore the location surrounding Kanakt to find it. Quest. Earn a Menhir Rights Seeker card. So we need to find the Menhir Rights Seeker card. To do so, you will have to explore the location surrounding Kanakt. Success. As soon as you have, you have Menhir Rights, resolve the Chapter 1 Part 5 card from the event deck and discard this card. Remember not to change the structure of the rest of the deck. Yeah, Matt. Hint, if this oh, is your no. first game, try to return to Connacht at the end of the day and spend the night there to read the dream, as dreams often contain hints. When is the end of the night after everybody goes? Once everybody passes, like, yep. you know, so then that then we mm -hmm. go into essentially the night yep. phase. So the, the, each round is played in three phases, start of day, during the day, end of day. So start of the day, we remove all the expired menhirs and discard locations that are out of the range of any active menhirs. We have one. 
Then we will reduce all time tokens and menu dials. This one's already been reduced because it's deja vu. Uh, reveal the next event card, move guardians, and then pick active items and secret cards. So, we have done all of those. That was the first event card we're revealing. Right. Um, so now we'll move on to the during the day phase until everyone is either out of energy or everyone has passed. Right. Once you have passed, you are out for the rest of the day. Right. Just so you know. So, these are, aside from the main village, which we discussed before, and has the ability to gain rep by doing chores for the village folk, um, and of course can be explored on its own, we have the Hunter's Grove, where you can spend two to gather food, gain two food, and draw one green encounter. So that's likely going to cause another, uh, some kind of combat with something that could give us more food. The Warrior Fair is in 103. Spend four to do a combat trial. You lose one uh, health and gain one experience once per day. That's pretty nice to get to things. Huh? We, um, then we have four energy Charred Conclave. Uh, draw one gray encounter when you enter this location, so you automatically have to do that. Yep. But it is a con but it is a charred conclave, you know, where druids would have been. And we have forlorn swords, which is giant swords in the ocean. And for one action, you can visit this, or for one energy, you can visit the smith shop. Pay one wealth, draw one craftable item. Ooh. Right. I so, like that. so the craftable. So, what, a lot of times when you're drawing yeah, items, you're doing whatever else in the I game. I haven't shuffled these. We probably need to. Yeah, right? we do. Yep. We, we need to shuffle those. What will happen is, is like once you start to look through them, sure. there, there are going to be, um, there are going to be ones that actually have like a symbol on them that would be craftable or wouldn't. Yeah. So when you go to that, when you do a craftable item, I believe it's, uh, you a you C. draw until you get to the first one that has it. Yep. Sometimes it'll be like. Pick from the top three craftable items, right? So, so you gotta draw, draw until you get yeah, to three. Yeah, find yep. the right ones, right? Gotcha. There'll be some other things like it's that. It's the same for, like, if it says draw a weapon item. You yes. can draw until you find a weapon. Right. You can have unlimited items, but you can only have one of each item active per of, day. Of the five or whatever the I think it is. Types, it's yeah. like yeah. armor, sure. shield, weapon, yeah. weapon companion, and something else. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Yep. Unless something lets you break that rule. Um, and again, there's some... Is it one wealth? I got a wealth. I should go spend it and get me a weapon. Do it. Well, it's also the Smith's location. Again, remember that any of these places, they will all, they are all explorable. And a yep. big part of the story is Explore exploring everything. Yes. Yeah, trying to explore. I mean, again, we may not be Thanks, able to explore Matt. everything, but exploring a bunch of stuff is going to be important. I want to read the flavor text where we're at. Yeah. Its history is as vast as its graveyard. Its future is empty as its house is. Boy, that's depressing. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> Thanks for reading that, Matt. Yeah. It looked like a nice place until you read that. Yeah. So there's nobody here? Wait a second. We're sleeping in dead people's beds. That's right. So um, we get to choose what order we want to go in each round. I don't care who goes first. Um, we can break off into pair or in separate, or we can go all together. We can go in pairs. We can do whatever we want. Yeah. Josh can go off on his own, and everyone else can go by themselves. Sounds like a Josh thing to it do. It does sound like a Josh thing to do. You better believe so, it. Who wants to go first? Does inspecting a menu give you anything other than attempting to activate it? it? It's free, and it what it does is it tells you what you need to activate. It. Yeah. And that's at this, and that varies dramatically, and without having some idea of what you need to do, then it's going to be very difficult to know what you need. I, I will say this, we are definitely going to have to almost for it, certainly find at least one more event here and, and, yeah, or activate this one again just to finish this first one. And it says, going to have to find a new one or activate that one again. And on here it says the cost requirements are listed on the back of the location card. Right, but you're not, but again, you're not supposed to know that until you... Correct, well, you would have to explore first yeah. is what I'm yep. getting at. Well... No, you don't have to explore. No, it's a separate action. It's a separate action. Inspect the menu is its own Hi, action. Lucas. He's yelling hi. Hi, Luke. <laughs> hi. So, who wants to go? When do you get to spend experience? Is it in, at night? At night. Okay. Yeah. You spend it, but you have to earn it during the day. Yeah. So, obviously. And it oh. takes a is minimum of two? Or is it only two? in between no, chapters? It's, no, no it's, it says that down here. Uh... Oh, yeah, the other side of the card. Day, I want to say. Re rest, day, the rest. Third one, advance your character by spending experience. Yep, there you go. Third, yep. third, third, third section okay. of the there we end go. of day section. Oh. So, yeah. So, you, yeah. 
Yeah, no, the end of chapters, no. Yeah. Because we need it well mm, before that. Gotcha. <laughs> Well, Josh, I want to go to the floor and swords as well, so if you want to travel... Yeah, let's go together! Okay, so that costs one energy per person that's moving. Yeah, he's got that big hammer. Yep. Energy. All right, so, so you that's yours, action. Right, now, because of that, though, this gets revealed right away. Yes, because yes. Because there is a connection, so that is and you're now one away from that. Uh, we, so we didn't explore, we just traveled you to. You just traveled. You so just now, traveled. Grubwood is now available to travel to. You cannot travel diagonally, even if it's revealed. It's always orthogonally. But it's safe because of this diagonally. Yes. But this yeah. one can't be revealed because there's no... Yeah, if you go there, here. 120 will not be revealed. Correct. Right. Because Grubwood it's not protected. a lightning bolt, which means it happens when you go there. Explore when you enter this location. This, this and it's free. Exploration yeah. is free. Ooh, a free exploration uh, The one. flavor text for the location we just went to. Sensing their own end, four dwellers ordered giants to push humans into the sea. But the giants abandoned their weapons here. Wow. Maybe that's why our city is empty. It's possible. It's been 400 years since four dwellers were here, though. So? Okay. So, Steve, what do we want to do? I kind of wanted to go to the Charred Conclave. Probably not the greatest idea. I can go there alone, but I'm not very diplomatic, well, I don't think. Well, I can go there alone. Let, let, let's put it this way. I, I figure one of two things. We either should probably explore where we're at yeah, that's or probably go not to a that bad other idea. spot and explore that. That was the one what? you were talking about. The go, go charred conclave. Yeah, like I would, I would say, I would, I would certainly be down for either one of those. If you want to do one of those on your own, I will do something different. I'm going to completely leave it up to you. Let's, so all of us haven't played. Joe played single player, which is not this at all. Which is not this. No. Stephen has played this. Though. I have played. I played the, this first scenario. Though there can be tons of differences, I did not play as the same character, and I played a little way into the second, well, about halfway into the second scenario, and then we had to save because it took too long. Gotcha. Save. It, we played two games and it lasted, essentially started playing by, say, 11.30. And though we did stop for some food and whatever, we didn't get done until 10 o'clock. Wow. Okay, let's get this long. move on. Yeah. This one was much shorter, though, than the other one. Let's go to Chard Conclave, Steve. Go to Chard Conclave? Yeah. Okay. Can you pay uh, an energy? Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, yeah, I'll yeah, pay yeah, an energy, yeah, too. Yeah. All right, so now we go back to well, you. everyone else. You, can, can, you, you have choices when you do that type of thing. Wow. All right, so we've all done stuff. Do you guys want to explore first, or do you want to do the action first? Or I do want you guys to go to the Smith shop. Okay. okay. I'm going to pay one wealth. Okay. Well, it cost me an energy, so yep. I'm going to do that. I'm going to pay one wealth. Okay. okay, and you draw one craftable item. So there it is. <laughs> it's got a C on it for craftable. I got a snare. Can you trade items? Yes. You're, you may want to read the thing for... Oh, no. Yeah, it's probably fine. I was going to say, I think there was a thing about how when you're drawing craftable items, it's it's you may still draw three, three and, and only purchase keep one. one. Okay. Yeah, you may want to double check that. Okay. But you can read that one if you want to read it. I don't want a dumb snare. I want something better. Oh, that's what you're stuck with. You're good at catching animals. Mm, uh, for one energy, toss a dial out of settlements. Grail, gain one food. This Skull, is combat. Something like that. Diplomacy, it's not that. It should be in the item section. You're an item. Let me check the index. Page 8 or 12. Some of the items, da, 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 you can have any number of items. Sometimes items contain C, these are craftable. Only ones that may be manufactured with player characters of crafting action or encounter reward ask you to draw a craftable item. Keep drawing cards from the item deck until you find the first item with a C sign. Take it and then shuffle the rest of the item deck. Okay. Ooh, we shuffled the item deck again. Yeah, yeah and then shuffle, shuffle the rest back in. Mm. Yeah. Snare. Yay! Did you I shuffle the deck? Oh, Four, yeah. Was that the first card? It was the yeah, very first card, around. yeah. He just, it just happened to Which me. is still my bad. Food is very important in this game and is useful for other things. No, well, you're done. Yeah, so that's yours. What did you want to do something now? I want I want a weapon. Okay, that's not item. an item, a craftable item. That is. Give me something good. Adventures kit. Ooh. No. Ignore the effects of heavy rainfall and unnatural chill events. Way better. Hmm. Interesting. You'll probably never have any of those, and then it will be useless. Oh, by the way, if you're in a spot, one of the things you can do is exchange stuff. Oh, Steve, we so, already messed up. Yeah. We came here, and we're supposed to draw a gray encounter as soon as we arrive. OMG. Oh, oh, my gosh. So this is technically last turn. So Rewind. It is. That's great. It is a mist-shaped vermin with it, four health. That figures you would have one of these. Yep. All right, so set it out. Okay. So, well, we need to turn to the right. The, so. That's fine. That's yep. fine. 
So who wants to attack first? Okay, so the first thing we oh, both we do is we draw, draw three cards. combat draw cards. Yep. Combat, and we have completely the ability to... And if it's all something. four of us in a combat, you only draw two, Matt. That is right, correct. Right. But if but it's yeah, is up to three of us, it's still three. Mm -hmm. So it is, it is tricky. Was enough. this specifically on top? Because this one has pointers. Yes. yes. Okay. So they, the, they, the top of each deck is your first encounter, okay. your first right. encounter. We didn't have to put it in, but I suggested it because I think it is a good idea. Um... So, so this, these will only be in here this one time. Then they're so out of the let's game. see. Then Matt can have them to remember how to use the cards. Yeah. Okay, so just to be, just so that, just, I'm not, I can't play off of aggression cards um, because I don't have those at this point. I don't have anything in my aggression yet. So okay. Just throwing that out there. Jeff. Um, what, what, okay, what does he need to defeat it, Joe? Four. It's got four? It's four? Yes, right? four, yep. So four, okay. Um, okay. All right. Um, I can do... Uh, so you kind of get to you look at him to see. So yeah, I don't understand the combat. All right, so here's so you have to match happen. everything. So let me see that card real quick, yep. and then I'll show you. So is this still kind of on the camera? Uh, no. If you can go down here. It would be sure, sure. So let's there you go. go. Let's put it there. So okay. So here's what's going to happen. We'll I got to look at my different locations. cards here, and you got the camera can't see this, but I'll show this. So I'm going to look at my different cards now. What I need to do is I need to line up with where these are at. So if I put this card out, this lines up all over the place on there, right? Uh -huh. However, th whatever is lining up must, I also have to have at least some of that attribute, an equal amount is what it shows. Uh -huh. So I have to have either one practicality to do this one, which I do, or an aggression. As long as I have either one of them, it goes off, right? Uh -huh. So in this case, I can do that. This means that it does one red damage toward the cards. So that's uh -huh. one potential combat. If I had a magic, I could spend the magic here, but I have no magic. And that would make that go off. I would have to little. I'd put the magic on there, and I'd do that. And the bottom is a free one that pretty much always. So I do one for that. So this card right here would let me do two damage. Then, if I want to chain off of that, one of my other cards that lines up like this has to have this lightning bolt symbol on it. Mm -hmm. Okay. The lightning bolt symbol has to also match up with something that I actually have an ability in. Right. Mm -hmm. Now, here's the other thing. If I put this out, this also happens. Flip over one weapon or shield that you're uh, using to gain two extra damage. So I would yeah. like shield bash or do whatever else. Because it's got this symbol, that happens immediately. Again, all of the symbol stuff is on yeah. this card right here. So that on this uh, combat uh, uh, or, or part of the icon the, glossary. Yeah. Yeah. Here, yeah. yeah. Um, all right. So there's that. Um, so if I want to put this one out, I could do that because this matches up and that would go there. I would do it because this is an X. It means that actually uh, cancel the next bonus. It cancels yeah. the next bonus. So it actually might not let me do that one there, but I could do this one here. Say just as an example, yep. if I did this one here, this would let me bone boost. I would put the two. Uh, I would do this where I could lose one and lose a uh, toss a, a dial, dial yep. and then do that next piece right. And then, again, I could then combo off of that because now that does connect, right? Um, it doesn't give me multiple plays. It only is one, yeah. but it's it would give double. But if I had a damage marker down there like that, it, right. would, it would deal two damage instead of one. Right, exactly, exactly. So so it's all about like putting down your cards in the right order. combinations that make stuff go off. Now, me do, generally, this person is a weaker person, like I said before, in combat. So if you you may be stronger at that, Joe, or you might not be. Technically, you were you're actually better at, at, at diplomacy too. We would have been better off, like the other way. like I any other combination would have been slightly better for this. Mm -hmm. Do you can you do any damage? I can. Well, the I two can. Muscle characters want to go get weapons. Right That's away. fine. It makes total sense. I can. Do you have enough that you can kill? And I got a metric no. kit, so I don't no. get rain. No. Now. I don't do get wet when it rains. Bonus draws. Okay. So, yes, and yeah. I can deal. Two damage to it, and then potentially draw a card, and potentially draw an extra card. Okay, so but let's you don't draw until the, the beginning no, of your next turn. No, you do it right away. Right away. If it, okay, if let's do that. These, if it's yep. in these, you do it immediately. So you're going to get a card right then. Okay, so but, I have a boar, so I can use that ability. Right, and Wait, then right. that allows me to draw a card. Card, but it doesn't do anything else. Oh, I can spend a magic to do damage. Well, hold on, though. Wait a second. I, I don't. I don't. I didn't want to play that one first. I'm yeah, sorry. I, was say, you might I wanted to play this one first. Just make sure that then this structures with what you with your bonus card and no in your hand. Oh, like in other words, does it have the chain off that does the Ooh, times one? It doesn't. You're right. right. See, that's the 
Well, I do have another one. Then that might be worth it. But it, all it does is let me draw a card, so I don't know if that's very useful. Well, yeah, because then it's giving you deeper into your deck. Okay, yeah. Right? Let's do if that you then. can chain off. Now, do you put this down first and then chain off of that? It to do that? It doesn't let me draw a card. I'm lying. It's just a bonus action. So, no, I can play one card. <laughs> So, well, does that bonus action do anything? No. no well, isn't this draw a card action... right here, Joe? Yeah. Yeah, that's, oh, that yeah, that one lets me draw a card, yeah. Right, right, right. right. And you that... get that flip a thing, don't right. you, to do damage. Right, you do a couple things. So, yep. so that's so probably a good this. one to yep. start. So you have this, right? You have the practice. I do you not have practicality, okay. but I so, can draw a card for... But you will do one yep. because of that. So you've done one. Now, does he have to take one off practicality? No, you just have to have it. And now I'll do the on placement, toss a dial. Okay. Not skull. Okay, so uh, uh, skull do that. Grail gain two damage. Gain two damage. Nice. You need two more. So there's three. We only need to do one more damage. Ooh, I don't have two. Oh, uh, but aggression. you automatically draw a card. I did draw so a card. You did draw a card. So now can you do one more damage with anything? Yes, and it has the bonus to play again. But so do I you have two practicality? Ooh, I don't. You have to have the nope. two practicality. I have zero. Do any of yours have the have it in the right spot? Period. No. So that's going to be the end, then. I have one, but... What does it do? Show, just put it out. It's not it's, it literally would just let me play okay, as a card. Right, right, but that might still work. Could, well, right, it does. But we could, because now can you link up something else that actually works for you? I guess I could link this one up, because it lets me play another one. Right. And, and then I can draw, draw another card. card. Right, yep. yep. And... That's a one X on the bottom. There's your other damage. But this, it doesn't have a lightning bolt. You can't keep playing cards unless they have lightning bolt. Right, that, it has that, to have the lightning bolt that fits somewhere. This lightning bolt that gives you the bonus to, action. If you don't, oh, you, I otherwise, thought, I thought that was the next. Card. You you can only play one card at a time, or per per round, that, unless you get the lightning bolts right. lined up. That doesn't line up. I mean, so now in I'm. In some cases, you get limited. So. Now I'm done. I can't. Okay. I don't have any more lightning okay. bolts. But what's nice back. is it prevents. Right. So yes. it does prevent one. So yeah. so now we look down here. We've done three total damage. Yep. If you've done three, we lose one, so it's actually down to two, but it doesn't do any damage to you anyways. Right. So it doesn't hurt anything. So that's Gold. fine. So now Steve gets to kill it. So now I've got to go on and kill it, which should be no problem. Can you start a, a new chain? Uh, yeah, but I, but you leave this out, and I will start from here. I don't yeah, he have starts to match on my... any of this. Oh. I don't have that's to match to any of that. Okay. Yeah. Um, Can you guys split the damage between each other, too? No. It like attacks one attack, and attacks yep, the other. So right. I fight it and it attacks back. So Steve fights that, it and attacks back. And then I will do this, which does one, two for that. Um, and I can't do that right there. It doesn't do anything. But that'll, okay. be, that'll uh, and that. Uh, Let's you play it. Wait, hold on. No, nope, I can't do that. Freaking oh, no, but I can still do it with the bottom. The bottom is a free. Uh, oh, no, that doesn't let me do the, the bonus. Hold right. On. You can just play that card, though, right? And just play the one card? Yeah, but it won't do enough damage on it. Oh, yeah, I, I still need to do two damage. That's so pretty much you have to play a card that matches the, at least one of these to get it to play? Yeah, but only those trigger. Whatever it matches will be the only ones that are allowed to trigger. Got and for it to trigger, you have to have... Yes, you also have to have... So, the, if, so if it has, like, this one has a double boar head, you would have, have, have two, two in right. the board. You, yeah, you have to have at least two in there. Cool. Um, yeah, it's an interesting system for combat. And diplomacy is the same, essentially. So, you're a diplomacy. Boom! Diplomacized. So Josh and I have taken two turns. This is the end of your first turn. Yeah, this is yep. end of our first turn still. Yeah. So, and we forgot to do something else, which we'll do after Steve's done here. Yep. You forgot to put the other locations yep. out. And you forgot we... to read your flavor text oh, on yeah. yours. The wind that ca caresses the long grass of this desolate highland right. also carries the smell so of burnt flesh. This. It smells wonderful. It's like a glade plug <laughs> Burnt flesh. I think it smells like I, steak. I'm going to do that, and then I will do the, I mean, it's, this one. Meat is meat, Joe. usually smells about the same. Okay. Burnt hair stinks. Lose one and toss the dial. Head skull. On skull. Call four. Uh... Resolve an opportunity attack. So run away. So uh, it just so runs, it runs away. away. Yeah. It just goes on the bottom of the deck. This yep. one will just go out of the game. Yep. And then you want to see it? Yeah. Yep. 
It got away. All right, so <laughs> I'll put these out. So do you guys gain that. experience or anything because no. it ran? No, because gotcha. literally nothing happens. If you, we took damage, we were just taking the damage and been done with it. So then you just shuffle your deck, you just shuffle your deck back up. Yep. yep. So we revealed the whitening, or not the whitening, just whitening, and Island Asylum. Ooh. Right. Oh, you can get wealth there. Yep. Pay so, one wealth to gain three yep, hearts. Lightning, um, oh. When you go there, you draw a blue encounter card, and for one energy, you can trade with the townsfolk. Pay one food, gain one wealth. Uh, the Island Asylum, if you go there, you can pay one energy for healing rights. You pay one wealth for three health back. Guess I shouldn't have spent my wealth on the first turn, but we'll get more somehow. So th this is an unfriendly settlement. Um, you can dream a, a there. A vineyard goes there as well, it says. It will once we explore or once we look there, activate, activate it. yeah. We have to find out how to activate yeah. it, and then we do. But there's one there, yes. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this should be on four. All right. Um, now it's so your guys' second now turn. Now it's our second yes. turn. So do we want to explore there, or do we want to do something else? Maybe you guys should separate, and then we meet up with one of us. I can't. Well, one of, someone will have to go back to the middle. Yeah. Oh, you can go down. There's no, you can't. We can't go across. Two. Yeah. It's a, if there's no number that connects the two, then they're not technically connectable. Um, we can we meet back up in the middle. Should one of us go to the? Well, that's a diplomacy one, right? The, no, that's blue. Yeah, blue is diplomacy, isn't it? Yeah. I don't know, Steve. What do you think we should do? I kind of want to explore this place since we're here. Explore it. I think it's worthwhile exploring wherever we're at yeah. if we're going to take the time. Let's do it. We are going to run out of time over time. Do we want to explore that... separately or together? We'll, we'll explore it together. Okay. You know. 104. Let me go there. <coughs> are you flipping it to show Charred people? Charred Conclave. But... What? Are you flipping it to show people that there's a double side? I know you don't have to, but... Yeah, it's, it's in the book as well, but in the back of the card it says the same thing. It doesn't take long to okay. find it. You just, just have to follow your nose. Yeah. The remnants of an enormous wicker man kneel at the bottom of a small veil. Nicholas Cage perched on top. Yes. You were here Burning when it man? was set alight. Wicker man. Years ago. The day was wet. The wicker man smoldered but didn't burn. <laughs> What's sad. Its victims, dozens of tightly packed druids, are still inside. Their melted faces and charred beards mm. pressed against the bars and looking toward the gray, silent skies. Barely audible, ceaseless whispers seem to fill the air. If you're playing Maggot, or if he's in your party, go to verse 10. Oh, well, look at that. I'm glad I came here. Verse 10. Maybe. The lipless mouths the lipless mouths sneer at you. The melted fingers seem to beckon and call you. An angry whisper grows like the sound of the sea. Finally, oh, you... Oh, hold on one second. Before you go any further. On your little personal card thing. Person. You know, the, the personal thing. Oh, yeah. For yourself, scan that real quick to yourself. Is there a part about you interacting with, with druids? I probably should have read this, huh? Yeah. <laughs> I was going to read it after. We should have actually read it. To, we should have read, probably read these out loud because they're pretty, they, 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 they're pretty interesting. Did, uh, did you have an interaction with druids before? I am a druid. Oh. According to this. Yeah. So, and, and which I knew that. Anything, did it say anything else? Not really, no. No? Okay. Right. Wait. The flip. Oh, yeah. Okay. Wait, what else does it say, Joe? I admit, I wanted to flay every druid until I discovered the reason. <laughs> okay. Yeah, alright. Let's, uh, I might read that here. So anyways, finally, you realize that they want you to come inside. To so step beyond the charred bars, where their black arms and melted fingers may close around you into a place where your life should have ended with theirs. Go inside. Requires maggot or something else. Put your ear to the bars and gather what you can from here, or leave. Give us three options. Mm -hmm. yep. Go inside, put my ears to the bar, or leave. I'm definitely not leaving. Do I go inside? No, because I'm trying. Us to... is a party, so the, you know. So. Oh right, we okay. Yeah, so I don't. We'll go together, or we or or we won't. I think going inside sounds bad because they want like they want to wrap my their arms around me and end me. <laughs> so I feel like if I go inside, that will happen. Put my ears to the bars. Yeah. Are you asking what I would do or what you put, should do? Put my ears to the bar. Okay. I think that's what I'm going to do. If that, if you're okay with that, Steve. 
I'm going to leave this one to you. Okay. I, this one I definitely know okay. at least part of what's going on. Put your ears to the bar and gather what you can. From here, go to verse 5. After a while, you learn to distinguish singular voices in the maddening cacophony of whispers. Several threaten you or throw curses for what your kin have done to the druids. Some cry out in agonizing pain. One describes a secret invocation and a forgotten ritual. If you have at least three magic... Ah! Nope. Nope. Go to verse 3. Each party member gains one magic. Each party member who has at least one bird... Empathy gains one madness. Oh. Or f terror. terror. Exploration ends. So I gain a magic. I do not have empathy. <laughs> That's it. I have a question. Yeah. Can he can he explore the same thing again yes. now that he has three magic? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yep. Yep. You can go back in and so watch something. something else could happen. Right. Mm. Not right. Right. So Is yeah. it worth the time? Don't know. But. All right. right. Maybe I'll go back. Maybe I'll go in the cage. I'll left. So now it's turn three. Yep. Right. Yeah, it is. Yep. So do you guys want to do? Go ahead. Since Josh, we just finished. Explore the forlorn swords area. Sure. Forlorn oh, swords. One oh five. five. Got to lose an energy pool. Yep. We got three. You rest a while in the shade of three a left. of titanic swords. Their rusty smell causing your nose to tingle. A hundred yards away, an elder smith toils, chipping at the jagged edge of a giant weapon. The hammer he uses to break apart the ancient steel seems very strange, as does the sound it makes. If there's a quest token, there's not. Otherwise, choose one. Attempt to climb one of the swords. Is that gold you see high up on the pommel? Try to talk with the smith. Rest in the shade of the sword, or leave. I say we try to talk to the smith. That sounds like a decent idea. Okay. If there's a dial on this location, there's not. If you're playing Bjor, or if Bjor is in the party, you know the Smith. Hey, hey! He is, and your missing master used to be friends. Yep, used to be. Go to verse four. You apologize to the man politely and thing, then hang back, watching each strike of his hammer against the surface of the sword produce a sharp tingling sound. This old steel was shaped not with a tool but with a song. The Smith explains after a while. It takes the same pitch to break it apart. This hammer I have remembers the music of the Ford Weathers. After a while, the smith gathers rusty ingots from the grass and invites you to his hut, where he shows you the rest of the process. If you don't have the riddle of old steel status, each party member gains one experience. Okay, so two things. You need one of those sheets from the thing that's got the big, like that, because we need to start marking the, that off. Each player needs one? No, one okay. person needs it. As long as anybody's got the things, the statuses, then it's good. Okay, okay. And it'll be on the back side of one of the sheets. Oh boy, what was it called again? The old... The stump, something of the... Riddle stump. of Old Steel. So you each gain one experience, because we don't have that. And then we gain it. Okay. The party does, I believe. Or our group does, party. essentially. The whole, the whole group does. Those count for everybody within the group, so if anybody yep. in the group has it, then we've got it. Then choose one. Leave. Attempt to buy the hammer. Attempt to steal the hammer. Do we choose as a group, or is it just Josh? No, oh, you do. Well, well, we don't have any wealth. You can try and steal it, Josh. How good of a relationship did, did your guy have with him? Uh... So, I guess I could read the next part to tell you, because it doesn't say what happens. Right? The pay part? So that way I they know. So. Well, what is it? What is it? Once, okay, so attempt to buy the hammer only if you don't have secret card 27, which you don't. Right. Pay from 1 to 5 wealth, then check the result. Right. right. Generally speaking, what you would do based on the thing would be where you're, yeah. Because I, I don't want you guys to say attempt to buy the hammer if you don't have any wealth at all, right? Yeah, I'm not going to. And the yeah. other one is attempt to steal the hammer or leave. Right. If you don't have secret card 27, you can attempt to steal. Josh, you need a hammer. We can try and steal it. What? Mm, who's this guy again? What's his name? Bjor. No, no the guy we're Bjor. talking to. Oh. The guy we're talking to. It doesn't say his name, I don't think. Yeah, just the Smith. The he Smith. Used, he used to work with your lost master. Mm-hmm. Mm. Be careful about reading too much. <laughs> That's a joke, uh, because you don't want to... You don't want to taint the. Oh no! I was just I was just reading the last part that yeah. I read to them already to see if it had his name. I've not I've not looked at anything that yeah. they have not said to read. Mm -hmm. no, you, just, you had excited eyes. That's all. Mm. <laughs> you decide, Josh. This is up to you. You're the Smith. 
I, I am it's, it's listening. Not, you're more closely related to this character. Yeah, awesome. So, so, so it's a good idea to, to <laughs> steal from the character. Us. Yeah. Oh, oh Jesus. <laughs> we spent our wealth. Want to get hammered or not? <laughs> you can always leave. Yeah, sh sure. Let's do something stupid and try to thieve something. Okay. Uh, you attempt to steal the hammer. Roll a die. Uh, the d6. Okay. One. And then add one plus one for each point of the practicality that you have. Whoever has the highest result. So one, so you just add one to your roll. Five. One through five. The smith catches you red-handed. <laughs> one through five! <laughs> you were so close, you need a six to get the different well, results. Figures, but... All right, uh, verse three. Tension runs high. You and the smith both have short tempers. A violent <laughs> fist fight erupts. Roll a die and add your bear. Aggression, I'm assuming. Yeah. Seven. Nice. Five plus. You manage to push him back and knock out some of his teeth. Each party member gains one experience, wow. one terror, and then you gain one wealth to split between the two of you. So what if you can have it, you beat him up. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Either way, exploration ends. Place a time token on the... Yep, on that spot. Dial... Uh, set to three and place it on this location. Right. When so, Dal ticks down to zero, discard it. So essentially, we won't be able. You won't be able to go back and interact with them for three turns. Hmm. He's got to calm down. Yeah, oh, yeah. Wait, like I, I, I just tried oh to steal my something. Gosh, Look at that. Yeah. It's right in there, Matt. Oh, it does have a three. Yeah, yeah. yeah they're, they're hard to see. Yeah, they, they were really right. hard to see. They, you know what? You, a wash. I know. Make a big I was thing. thinking a wash that. And then oh. If you just do the 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 numbers in a different color than the wash. Yeah. White. <laughs> or gold. Or, yeah. You know, you oh. could do the, the colors in gold and a Those dark wash underneath, it would be fine. Yeah. You know what, I mean? like the, what does reputation get you? Sometimes if you have reputation, different things will happen. People okay. will say they'll give you things or they'll help yeah. you out when normally they wouldn't. Yeah. Okay. Generally or maybe bad speaking, things could happen. Generally speaking, having more of any one thing is better than having not as much of any one thing. All right, Steve, what are we doing? Um, well, do we explore again or do we do something mm. else? I don't know. Are we wasting too much time here? I only got two more turns. I mean, okay. Because I, I, I don't want I, to become I exhausted. Could explore again. What we need I to feel do safe though. exploring without you, though, as well, if you don't want to stay here. But I feel like my character would be interested to learn more about the druids. Well, the thing about it is, is and this is just a general thing from what I, you know, just generally, I feel like if, if we're, if we're going to stay, if, if you're going to stay, I probably would rather stay. Since okay. we are still early in this thing, this is not imminently going True. dark. Okay. So I would rather stay than go at this point. Okay. You know, like that type of thing. You but, want to explore again then? Uh, yeah. If you're, if right. you're, you're going to explore again, then yes, I will go. Over I'm going to look further into this wicker man. I'm in the only thing is you don't want to get down to one. Uh, you yeah. want to stay at two. That's exactly. That's why I said I only have first. two more. Yeah, okay. Just reminding you. So you're going to pretty much go back to that. You, you can rest out in the other part. You don't have to be by the mentor to get... You yeah, know. we each have a tear we probably want to get rid of. I am the only one that doesn't get rid of Yeah, my, yeah, my you... Oh, yeah. You, yep. you would, you okay. would, you're right. Um, you still want to be in a place that dreams, potentially, but not necessarily... But that doesn't have to be in that place. Yes, go ahead. It's the same thing again, right? Go to... Ten. Ten, ten yep. yep. The lipless mouth sneer, blah, blah, blah. Do I want to go inside this time or put my ears to the bar? Mm-hmm. I should probably just put my ears to the bar so we can see what happens with the magic this time, right? Because we have more magic. That's one train of thought for sure. I would have gone in and Hey, guys. You think so? I would have. But that's that's what I would have done. I also tried to steal with Josh, so... That's true. My guy is... I gotta play... I gotta think like Maggot would. Okay. He's recovering addict. He's going in to see what's in there. Okay. I like it, Matt. So we're going in. Requires Maggot or at least one... Ow. Oh, oh, spirituality. Okay, go to verse 4. We're walking in. You break some of the bars open and step inside, choking on the foul smell. Closer! A voice in your head says. You lie between the charred carcasses and feel their arms wrap around you. That's so warm. Closer! The voice repeats as hands begin to pull you in. Try to break yourself free or lay still. I can't give you more advice. I want to lay still. I'll do what you do. Okay. Each party member loses one hit point and gains one terror. Okay, good start. 
If you have the charred knowledge status, go to verse 5, which we don't. Otherwise, go to, and it's a secret. Okay. Okay. So you need to put out the things, right? I guess. Yeah, yeah. The, There's just three, three of them, yeah. Yep. Yep, you, you put, put them, them on them there. in the same position. Oh, just like they actually look? Yeah, yeah. and oh. then the number at the bottom is what you read. Okay, it's just going to be 444 four then, because yep, they're all facing four, the same four, way. Four. Yep. Okay. Yep, so 444. Four, four. That's cool. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's really cool. All right, so to the secret journal. Are you sure it's 444? Four, four? This, this, yeah. yeah. The, the red yeah. Thing, right? This, uh, this was uh, Tom Vassell's number 12 of all time. Are you sure it's 444, four, four, Joe? Yep. The, okay. bo the Whatever's underneath the skull, that number. That's one. Is it one? Yeah. Count up. Oh, you're right, it is. Gosh. Does that look like a... Look at under the skull. What is... <laughs> It so looks like an upside down V. That's a one because there's two, three. Now. Yeah, yeah, two, three, okay. four. One, one, one. Sorry. Yep. Good, hey. good call, Josh. Yeah, I'm like. Mm. Is the BOS the secret? No. No. Yeah, that seven is horrible though. Most of those it numbers are It should be in the very, horrible. very, very, very back. Maybe. It, oh, but probably not by the. Over the cards. Tutorial. Thickest mm -hmm. cards I've seen in the game, I think. Thickest, you said? Yeah. They yeah, are BOS pretty good. is Book of Secrets. Book of Secrets. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. yeah, yeah. yeah. Sorry, I no, didn't know. It, okay. I didn't think about it. I was thinking of it. One, Those are the bosses. One, one. Deformed fingers. This sounds right. Dig into your skin. Bodies push from all sides, nearly crushing your ribs. Charred lips whisper into your ears. The pain is immense, but after a while, you understand. They're not looking to punish you. They want to pass on the knowledge lost with them. Each party member loses one hit point. We're doing great, Steve. But gains an experience! Yeah. Gain charge secret card 11. If you don't have it yet, gain the charge secret status. Okay. Just charge knowledge. Charge knowledge status, I'm sorry. Oh, these are the secrets. Okay, so 11. They are not in order. Yeah, I was going to say, hand them to somebody and we'll do it. Do you want me to do it since you're going to be taking the turn? I think Joe just wants to do it. No, I'm not doing it. I'm just He's looking for 11. I'll <laughs> well, put them in order. Yeah. I was just going to find 11 for him even. 11. It was l right there. Okay. There's literally secret, the secret, secret, like. secret, secret, secret. There we go. Well, be in order. Yeah. Okay. I guess I can flip this over. I don't, no one looks at this, though, do they? No, you, you, go ahead and look at it. You'll know. Men here writes... You can now activate Minyars. Right, that's what we need. The cost this. of this action can be found at the back of each location with the Minyar symbol. Right, so, so, so that yeah. was that. What else does it say there? Uh, congratulations, you've completed your first quest. You now know how to wake the ancient Minyars. When you finish a quest, make sure to f always follow the instructions in the success section of your quest card. New task, go to the location with the Minyar icon and activate its Minyar before your time runs out. Expiration ends. Okay, so our expiration ends, and I'm here, success, as soon as we have been here rights, then uh, do chapter one, part five card. <clears throat> A journey begins. Uh, despite your best efforts to learn and perform the ancient rite, the men here in your town seems beyond your help. Disheartened, you realize your only hope is to try to enable one of the two statues from the nearby locations. Quest, activate a men here in one of the nearby locations, four Dweller Mounds, 106, four Whitening, 107. Okay. Um, success, when you activate one of the men here, resolve the part one, part, uh, chapter one, part six card so from the event deck, or there. and discard this card. So this is our current... Uh, we haven't found 106 yet. No, but right. what we will know soon. Um, and that, so that's uh, our next, our current thing. So if I would have uh, checked this one, would it have told me anything that I couldn't have done it? What's that? Remember how you can expect them in here? If I would have expected this, would it have said something? It, we, it'll, there, it's not impossible to do. Okay. It's okay. just much tougher than the yeah. other ones. Okay. Uh, okay. Alrighty. Yeah. Josh, so, you want to go to Grubwood? Is that the free exploration it one? Is. Yeah, let's go there. Let's go to Grubwood. I'm down. What, look, uh, it's 108? Some think it was given the name because it fed settlers in dire times. Others believe it's due to the maggots crawling over its slumping trees. Ooh, oh. look, there's like a, a frog bird with the snake tail. Oh, that's dinner. Frog bird frog with snake, bird, snake tail. tail. Grubwood! Yeah, this is my favorite cartoon from that block in back in the morning. Mm -hmm. Even in broad daylight, the grubwood is not a good place to be. Its old trees bend towards each other like whisper, whispering hags. 
Old chains attached to treetops chime with every good. breeze. The ground under them is foul and drenched in some strange substance. Hmm. As you inspect it, you're startled by a hooded figure that watches you from behind the trees. Yep. Its freight cave <laughs> arches upwards on its back as if covering a pair of wings. When the creature realizes you've spotted it, it runs away! <laughs> Intrigued, you give chase, but after a while it disappears between the gnarly trees. Tired, you lean on one of the trunks only to discover that it is crawling with fat white maggots. Dinner. Remove this location card from the game and, re and replace it with location 110. So rip it? It's a legacy game? N no. no. Exploration ends. Haunted grub wood. Oh, good. Whoa. The flesh of fat worms that crawl over the slumping trees is pungent and gooey. The sound they make when thrown into boiling water resembles a child's shriek. For one action, we can cook worms. Gain one terror and one food. Yummy. Oh, nice. For an action? Yeah. yeah All right. Fancy. Steve. Can we dream there? There is dream there now. Oh, there was yeah. a dream there before. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, there's a dream Well, it's there. just silly Grubwood. Who cares about we'll that? We'll spend the night in Haunted Grubwood. I'm late! Right. Do we dream together? How does that work? It's... You, you, I'm assuming yeah, you dream separately. Yeah, you kind of dream together. Kind of. Um, what are we doing? I... I mean, we know the, we need to go to Whitening, right? Or White... Yeah, Whitening. Yeah, if we want to see what that does, we should certainly do. Which means... But as soon as we do, draw a blue encounter when we... Yeah. ...enter this location. So are we good with that? I mean, we are really good at that type of... Yeah, let's do it. All right, cool. So, one to go there. Um, get some energy to do that. And, uh, yep, go ahead. Okay, it is the Suspicious Guard. So, this is a diplomacy uh, yeah. fight. So, what is with the uh, magical so that, track here? So, here's what happens. Yep. This one it starts in the middle. Different. Starts in the middle. We want to get it to the top before it reaches the very bottom. If it ever reaches the very bottom, we lose. If we get it to the top, we win. Since there, since there can be... More sometimes there's more than one section. In this case, there's only one section. Uh, but sometimes if there's more than one section, you have to get it to the top. Then you move to the next section, you get to the top, and move there. You know, so you have to complete right? multiple yeah, sections. Yeah, that's fine. Sections. So that's got room for cards. Uh, excuse me. Uh, Too bad it's like super bright over there. Okay. Explain yourself. Okay, hold on one second. Now there are some bonuses to this. Um that are important in what we're looking at here because notice this symbol here, Joe, this, uh, the effect on the, so this is the effect sometimes. So we may get bonuses off of that if that shows up. Right. That makes it go up. The Celtic Anytime effect. Made, yeah, the, it, that, that symbol. So for every one of those we match, that's going to make things go up. The Celtic trifecta. Yeah. I'm going to look at my another curiosity if I get shuffled anyway. Yeah, yeah. Yep. Just so I can handle it in the game. Yep. Okay, what is the affinity? Where is that? Oh, that's the where we are in the track, right? Yes. Yep. Yep. That's how up or down. Yes. That's the affinity track. Are you looking um, at your diplomacy? See what they do. Hmm. What if dis if you discard the last card from the sequence, gain one? Right. So oh. sometimes something will make you discard the last card in a sequence, like as and part if of your that journey. happens, if that happens, then that thing would go okay. off. I can start, I guess, or well, do you... Well, well, oh, oh, okay, okay, so we need to do a total of three move-ups. Yep. Can you do that? The little This little symbol uh, makes it move up, right? Right. Or what if you if have you, an up or arrow? Or if it's an up arrow, it would make it move up, depending on how it moved up otherwise. The reason why yes. I'm asking, the reason why I'm asking is, is because Whoa. I, um, now that I have the magic, I could probably... Is this a legacy game, Joe? No, why? Because the show's like a tearing of a that's, card. That's discarding if, the last yeah, card. discard the yeah. last card. In the well, I was like, that's like looks like it says rip the card in half. So I can spend one magic and get it up three in one turn. I, but if you can too, then that's up to you. Whoa. Yeah, I mean, I I can do that at least. Hold on a second. I'm Remember, you can go back down here and still talk to them about <laughs> with your three magic. True. I'm sure it doesn't matter at this point. Technically, I actually, can I can do, I, can I can play one four. card. Yeah, I can do four between my two cards. I can do a three in one card. Oh, you can do three in one card. Yep. Then, then go ahead and do that. Because this happens when you play it, right? If affinity is not green, which it's gray right now, right? Raise it up one. Right. 
and then I have an owl, right. so it goes up one, and yeah. then this just goes up goes one because it's free. You've also drawn a card. A card too, yeah. And continue on. We do. Yep. So we're good. Man, I'm so awesome at diplomacy. So the holy verse. The reward is yeah. one reputation. Sweet. So we gotta split it. Yep. Go ahead. Take it. You take it. Okay. Yeah. I'll let you, you finished it. I'll let you do it. Okay. There you go. Thanks, Steve. This is there. That's there. That goes on the bottom of the deck. Out of the game forever. Game. Yeah. Do you want to look at this one too? Since it's a diplomacy, yeah. it's oh, a little yeah, different. <laughs> this is where that little green screen thing would work, Joe. It would, yeah. Mm -hmm. One more camera and we'll have that. Yep. Mm -hmm. Well, what we'll do is upgrade that camera and use that credit camera exactly as a close. Exactly, is the plan. Yep. All right, well, that was our round. We uh, yeah. we moved and did the free thing. Yeah. We can uh, trade with well, the townsfolk. Well, here. yeah, that yeah we moved and then that happened. Yeah, it was the instant so, action, yeah, I guess. So that happens every time we uh, go there. We can actually do the free action of examining the menu. That's a free action? Yes, it's worth zero. I'm 99% sure it's considered a free action. Yeah, it says inspect yeah. men here, yeah. zero. Zero, it's zero energy. I just didn't know if oh, you could... It's an action, though. So it it's takes not, the it's turn, energy. yeah. It's not zero It's still energy. an action, yes. just doesn't take yep, energy. Yep, so gotcha. your guys' turn. Yep. Well, you or, two. or we can go again, whatever you want to do. Because yeah. technically we're back around to the same point. Do we want to dream together, or should I move? I guess I wouldn't, I wouldn't mind having all of my energy back, so... Yeah, if you spend another one, remember, you won't get... It. I won't go to full. Yeah. Either and way, Josh, if he five, spends another, he will I'm take fine. damage. Nope, I got... Oh, you have one more spot. I have still. one more okay. spot. Never mind. Do you? Why do I have one less? Here? Because it's We're different. Everybody's different. It's, it's, it's different for everybody I in that I started at six. What did you start at? Six? Well, we spent the same amount of energy. Then we moved one. Yep. We explored. explored. We, we moved you, to the we, other one. We moved. We spent wealth. We explored. We moved. That's four. Okay, yep. So, one, two, three, four. Okay, I was all, one off. Okay. Genie. Already. Co op payment. Man. Uh, all right, well, there you go. Now I guess you have your answers. You will take damage, which, if no. you sleep you and you, you eat, you'll mm -hmm. gain one hit point back, but. But you also won't gain you have quite as much energy right. going into the next yeah, round. You'll be more tired. Because you only gain four back when you're here, so I would gain I'm up to five. If it's worth right. dreaming together, or if it's worth me moving over here and dreaming at this location. Yeah. I don't know. More information. Uh, I, I, I can tell you this much, and I don't remember any specifics. Sometimes when you dream, it's literally nothing. Sometimes when you dream, you can gain stuff. So okay? is, a dream, is a dream different at each location? It is different at, depending on location, but per person, you would all do the, get the same thing or not the same thing out of the location. So in other words, if this is going to give you one experience point or one hit point back or uh, wealth or some whatever it would give you, you'll all get it or none of you, you know, like or whatever, if you're both in that spot. If you're in two separate spots, I can't count on that because it could be I'm, I'm going to pass. Hey, Nicholas. He just uh, got uh, here. I'm passing because I don't want to okay. take damage. So put your, put your thing on here just to show that you're passed, and then that way you're done. Generally speaking, if you take your thing for the round, that would be good. I have one energy left. Uh, yeah, I mean, no, I have technically none. I should have stayed in the shard, 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 shard. Did you just start higher? Oh, yeah, you started at 7, didn't you? Yes, I did Whereas start Joe at started at 6? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, um, Nicholas says, y'all gonna die. Dreaming isn't always bad. The dream is always the same for an individual location. Yeah, yes. thank you. Yep. Uh, Spoilers. Come Spoilers. We, uh... I, what you missed, I just got... I just walked into the, uh... Wicker Man and was embraced and crushed and learned... Didn't one of us want to end here to dream here? That's what the hint was, anyway. Yeah, I did mention so. At the end of the day. That's going to be coming up next. Right. Mm. Well, yep. Yeah. Yep. I guess I can uh, move back there, but then I'll be exhausted at zero. That would be two moves. Yeah. Um, yeah, and you already passed. Yeah. I'm going to uh, spend my one energy to trade, so I will trade one food for one wealth, which is the action that's on the guard there. Um, okay. Yeah. I will spend zero energy to do the men here. Men here. Yep. Okay. Which is not in the book, I don't think, so. There, it is actually, I think, listed in there for the site. Oh, that's okay. Fine. Activate a menier. Requires all characters and the menier writes secret card, which we have. Right. Uh, pay three energy and one health. This should be getting written down. 
this is a thing that should probably be ready. Three energy, one health. What is this place called? Uh, whitening. Whitening or 107. You can just yeah, 107. There you go. All characters. Three energy. One health. One wealth. One magic. I said health, wealth. Magic. Magic. Per player. Mm -hmm. So that technically it's four magic, four wealth, four health. Twelve energy. Twelve energy. Right. And again, we can split that however you want. Uh, you know, so technically one person could have like ten of that. Uh, uh, you're like uh, f all four of the wealth. And then and nobody else has any wealth. You know, yeah, just that'll allow us to put the model out. Yep. All right. Uh, okay. Um, I'm going to pass. This sounds crazy, but I think I might move back to the Charred Conclave to dream there. You go? Go for it. I'm going to spend the energy to do it. Okay. Oh, I'm so exhausted. Okay. And now I'll pass. Okay. Okay. All right. So, so uh, end of the day. First we rest. So yes. consume one food, so get rid of one food, and restore one health. And lose one terror, except for I'm not going to lose a terror since I'm not by the exit so I'm traumatized. Yep. So that's kind of something. Uh -huh. um, then, um, if you don't have enough food, blah, 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 we don't need to restore to full um, energy if you're not exhausted. Yep. If you are, gain four. Yep. How do you gain your bonuses? I don't know. Probably some cards or something. Yeah, it. yeah, you, yeah, you, yeah, it's points where you... So get, really, I could have exhausted myself, but then later on, I would have only had... One last. Yeah. yeah. So, like, I only have five instead of six now, but... Yeah. Yeah. yeah I'm willing um, to try it. It'll cost one more magic to activate, because I'll be there. Yes. Yeah, because it's always... Because it requires right. all people. Yep. One more. Great. Thanks. Um, <clears throat> all right. <clears throat> uh, advance your character by spending experience. Nobody has enough, I don't think. Yeah, we do. Uh, mm -hmm. Two? Do you? Yeah. Or what? Two is uh, enough to... Draw three combat or diplomacy cards. And oh, that is true. I'm sorry, one. I forgot about that. Yes. Or you could upgrade, right? Uh, no, <coughs> not or unless you only have one point between the two sides. Gotcha. Between so the like two actually, sides. I could if I had an extra one because or no, no, you only have first one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No right, points. So once I have one, then I have to, yeah, it's going to cost more than that. Uh, but yes, you could if anybody wanted to could spend two experience if they had it to draw three combat or diplomacy cards, choose one and put the rest back and then shuffle that back in. Does anybody want to do that? Like are these good good, or are they just mediocre They're pretty good. good. They're, they're, they can be much better. The they food is not. the flesh of dead friends. Again, you draw the top three, so... Yeah, yeah. upgrading this pricey, Nicholas. You're right. Yep. Hmm. Interesting. No? Yes? I don't need upgrades. I'm maggot. Uh, I don't know. You can wait. I mean, we'll have more time. Yeah. Something makes you lose experience. <coughs> I don't. No, well, the, I don't the thing is, is, if he puts them in now, he puts the he would put that card in directly, mm -hmm. would shuffle it in, and could take one out, and could start actually doing that culling process if he wanted to. Yeah. Uh, again, if, I don't so know what deck. Yeah. I was that's like, right. I was like, I don't have that on my phone. No, nope, that's me. All right. So if everyone's I, advancing, yeah. then we go on to the next phase. Modify your decks. Spotify, which if you're at a location, yep. dream. So, so yep. we'll start so with you two since you're together. Uh, How's it? Yeah, or no? just, well, or do we go it's the lowest number. Okay, so you, me. You. Oh my gosh. 104. 104. Yeah, we'd be last. Okay. There should be a section that talks about dreaming. I don't know where it's at. There it is. I do have to flip to see if I get a nightmare instead. Yeah, that's right. I'm glad I'm not there with you. Nightmare. Oh! <laughs> well, this will be the first one of those. <coughs> we didn't get one of those when we played before. Your hands desperately tug at the bars of the cage, trying to pry one of them loose. Other people thrash around you in pure terror. Your lungs and mouth begin to fill with thick, oily smoke rising from those below you. Their screams no longer sound human. Finally, the flames reach your body, blistering your skin, melting your flesh. A moment of agony and terror, and then you're back in the cage again, in another place, reliving the execution once again and again. And again, for two hundred different for, from two hundred different perspectives, the dream seems to last forever and leaves you completely traumatized and shaken. Each character who has this nightmare loses one heart and gains one insanity or terror. Wow, job! Great job! 
the dream. Okay, uh, 107. Hey, you gotta continue on, Joe. You're yeah. the reader. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, no, that's fine. You can all, you can always give it up, no, Joe. You can't, Matt it's wants to be you. it too. Are we dreaming or nightmaring? I'm dreaming because I'm not terrified enough. You dream of home. I do. Your dream of home is understandable, considering for the first time in your life you've wandered so far from it. But why is everyone talking and walking backward? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's it. Ooh, yeah. Ooh. Okay. Uh, one ten. One ten. And they're gonna be dreaming too. Yep. We be Again, dreaming. Yet, so other than you, kind of. The only thing you remember in the morning is torment and indescribable pain. Your legs and arms feel like someone tried to rip them out of the joint at the joints. Each character who has dreamed loses one energy. What a jerk. Well, that sucks. <laughs> There's some creepy character okay. on the bottom now. I'm All right. Uh, um, yeah. And start the next day. So, yep. start of the day. Remove any expired menhirs and discard locations that are out of range. There aren't any. Right. Uh, reduce all time in menhir dials and remove time tokens on spaces where there's a time token. Uh, reveal the next event card. So, this is this to be the next Part two. Event. Yep. Exodus. <clears throat> Homeless vagabonds roam the roads and trails. Many hail from fishing villages further west, <laughs> where the last menhirs went dark weeks ago. <laughs> Though malformed and sick, they're the lucky ones. Their tails chill you to the bone. Is this the fate that awaits your land? <clears throat> Help the refugees. Each may player may spend one wealth or one food to gain one rep and one experience. Love you too, Nicholas. Goodbye. So what you is spend that? One health, or one wealth, or one food to gain a rep and an experience. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna give up a food, and I will gain a reputation and an experience. <laughs> do I give up a health? How do you get food? You um, have to go to places to get it. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, but gotcha. go, green events often give them to you. So, like, if somebody goes here, there's a good chance sure. you get several at some point in the future. Or uh, somebody has the ability to create food. Yep, he can create food. It's only once per day, I think, or something like that. But I feel like I can't over. pass this up. Uh, yeah. One yeah, rep and one experience. Yeah, yeah. All right. Um, okay. Don't so look is over that, here. So is it's that, bad. What? So is that that? Okay. Yeah. Um, now, uh, place five minus one per player. So four additional random events on top of the event deck. So take. four four off of that. Five thing. minus one per player? Yeah. So it'll oh, be one, one, right? Yeah, I'm sorry. Yep, one. Okay. Onto the, yep, onto that. That'll be that. Then discard this card. Hint. There are several ways these? to gather food or heal around your starting location. You may need to find them, though. Okay. Uh, I mean, we could eat these maggots, Matt. Yeah. It's not bad sure. for one, actually. Alrighty. Who's doing what? Uh, well, now we're separated. Mm-hmm. I don't know who made that idea. I need food. You need food. Yeah. I could go over here, but then I'm facing a green encounter by myself. Right. But that would give two. I food. can come up there, and then we could do the party travel thing. We could. Well, Josh, you want to get, eat maggots just so we have food? Yeah. you got to remember that we're going to need wealth for the man here. We didn't dis d explore this place, did we? No, we just did look at the menu. If you moved up, then right. we could explore. You could join me in the Health, explore. wealth, magic. Okay. Cause and energy. That, and then that way you would, we would go from there. So no food. Okay. Yeah, let's do that. Okay, so you're going to move up. Yep. The only place to get wealth is top right. I think. Uh, right now it is the only place to get it, yes. Yeah, Wasn't there something down here for wealth? And wealth. double check about the part about you going health. on an exploration. Mm. Not that oh, one, right. but any other while they're deciding what they're going to do. Joe moved up here. We're going to probably explore this space, but you guys go ahead and he's double checking it. So, what do you guys want to do? Oh, wait. Uh, that one, it triggered another encounter when I go there, wouldn't it? Yeah. It will. Right now, then. Yep. With just me. It will. Okay. But you're very capable of doing it. It's All a, right. Well, I, I guess I better do that first, then. Yeah. It is the temp. It's temptations. You may as well put it down by you. Visitors can indulge in many vices, none of them cheap or safe, all of them enticing. Oh, boy. That starts low. I, okay, so check two things on there. On what? The goat 
or let me see the book. Real yes. Quick. Okay. Let me see the book real quick. There is a glossary in the back. Because I want to see whether or not I can join you immediately. I may be able to, because I think I can join as part of the thing as you have that happen. Um. I just like on the back of these statues. There's a person. Hmm. If you look very carefully, I think this thing has like five arms. I like the decrepit, what I think used to be wings. Yeah. Okay. Oh, Josh. buddy. Now we lost our place. We're at three. Thousand. Oh, there's no magic here. Just, Just three. Biscuit. I don't know what number three is, because <gasps> this thing sucks. Three. See, look, guys. It looks like that. Oh, right there. Not tall enough to do this. Yeah. Arms are too short. Mm, trying to find the spot. There's, th there's a section that talks about playing. So what do we gain? Just one food when we do that, Matt? Yeah, you also gain a tear, though. If you're eating maggots. Meh. Okay. I'm going to try to use my snare while you're doing that. Okay. What does snare do? Um, I could possibly get food. Is that an action? Yeah. So you're doing that separate from me? Yeah. Okay. Grail, that's probably good. Um, Grail gain one food. Nice! I guess I'll do the food action. Do I have to read anything or do anything? Nope, just cook worms. Gain one terror, gain and, one and, terror and one food, and it costs an energy. Yep. That's cool, I get to keep this. That's better than I thought. Yep, I have a 50, 50 chance of getting food. Lost yeah. energy. Weapons if you fail, anything Gain bad. Oh, you lose it. You lose the snare? Yeah. Ah, I see. You lost it. I didn't. I'm, no, I'm saying. Shh. You lost it. You lost it. You're no good. No. Before we're going to spoil the game for you, you're up further ahead of us, you jerk. Because uh, we weren't in a party when we entered the spot. Okay. You're no good. Get no good temptations. Okay, doke. Well, let's go ahead and do this. It's a real roll of the dice here. Okay. But so it's the only one that's. You do the immediate Wait thing right a away. second. Hold on a second. Right there a minute. Yeah, I might not do that. What else we got? Yeah. Yeah. Let me see this one instead. I knew I should have dreamed of the swords. All right, let's play this one instead. I knew dreaming there was gonna be bad. Okay. Okay. And I can play... Okay, hold on, hold on, hold on. Yep. Back up. We back lost that energy, second. right? So what I would be down to four. Yeah. It gives me two bonus actions and ignore but all downs. it's only downs. one, so it's, it doesn't give right. me multiple. Right, so, yeah. so I'll play this one to get a bonus action. Okay. And it goes up one for the free. Yeah. You know, th this, it has an infinite, infinity sign. Does that mean I can do that as many times as no, I spend no, magic? No, I think you have to pay a magic no, to do it once. No, you have to pay once. a magic to do it once. Okay, I'll do that. Um... No, okay. just the ones. I don't think you get two. Oh, because that, that the free action gives me right. one. Yep. So, oh crap! I forgot. Hold on. Right. So it's here. That, that doesn't make any sense to do that. Yeah, that I was way. gonna say, why not do it the other way around? Because if yeah, it would fail either way, right? So I might as well do this one first. Well, well, why does it fail either way? Because if I get a skull, it goes down one, and if it ever reaches the bottom, you just fail, right? Yeah. But it does it the same because this one, the other card doesn't ra raise it at all, so. Right. Exactly. Yeah, yeah, that's my best Unless bet. You're, what's the third card that you have? Can you play the third card? I can, but it literally does nothing for me. Except oh, it gives it you other things to match up. Would that match up yeah. better to the other card? <laughs> it just gives me no. It's hmm. just playing it's it for no reason. Ignore one. all down arrows. And then af af you remove the last card after the response from them. And what's this one do? For every down arrow, up instead. Yeah, right. So, so but they yeah. don't—they don't give down arrow. So, well, if you played that first and then this, oh, never mind. Yeah. yeah. All right. All right. Oh, thank God. Good. Okay. So up one. So that and then goes up two more. Two. For that one, right? Right. Well, yeah. yeah why two yep. more? Because yep. that's two times, two times that arrow. That, yeah. mm. Right. I'm Which is why I was trick. saying to maybe go the other. That's why I thought maybe go the other way. But I do understand why you did what you did. All right. So then. Okay, so I have an owl, so I'm good there. That does nothing besides 
just let me play it. Right. But now I can play this. Nope, I can't because that doesn't have the extra action. So. All right. Well, that's that's it then. Okay. So then okay. now resolve its thing. So what does yep. it say under its negative? So lose one energy. Okay. Lose one wealth. I have no wealth, so ha. Okay. In your face. Yep. And then what does it say? Is that it? That's it. Okay. So now I'll draw back What's up to three, failure? right? That's if you fail, if it gets down to the bottom. Uh, yeah. Yep. Okay. So I'll draw so back draw up to three. No, you draw one. Mm. In between turns. You draw one card. You just draw one? I believe you only draw one. I thought you drew back up to three. Uh, it should say, and the, there should be a combat yeah. thing there. Yep. It should be the diplomacy. diplomacy. In turn, each party member discards down to three diplomacy cards. Discards down? Yeah. To three. Draw. Not draw oh, up to three. Okay, then draw then one draw card. Draw one yep. card. Okay, gotcha. <laughs> the example that I played through last night, you had you had two left, and they had you draw one, and then because I had the green plus sign, it was like, draw another one. Right. So I actually ended up, well, yeah, I gotcha. Anyways. Yeah. So again, this is fresh. It doesn't matter what your other things are. Yeah, you keep lining them up. Go ahead. Yeah. So I'll go up one again, well... Place yeah. two charges on a chosen card in the sequence. You're thinking it starts over, Stephen? Is that what you're there, thinking? There was, a, yeah, like, like I thought when you went into the second turn that it that it didn't matter what your that, previous that round it, was. It didn't matter Pretty where sure you were to line up. Let me, I'll double check. I could be wrong. Uh, You played an owl, right? So that would have made it gone up. So would that other one. You would have won last time. Wait, would it? Yeah, right there's an owl, and it would have gone up. That's the affinities. So you would have won last time. Is that what that means? Yeah. Check the effect on the encounter card next to the current stage of the encounter. Uh, for an up arrow, move the markers on the affinity track one space up. No, 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 no. It's if he, he, you have to have that symbol, and then if you do... Then it moves up based on the if you have a if you have any points in your uh, in your owl or you have any points in your other thing. Like so it's, words, it's when you it, play that it, symbol, right? So in other words, these diplomacy card would have had to have that symbol, which on. none of mine did. Oh, it has to have that Celtic symbol. Yes, yeah. exactly, exactly. Yep. Um, All right, so this place two charges on a chosen card in the sequence. Okay, I don't know what two charges do. What does that? What does that mean? <laughs> Why? When playing, wait, did I drop hold on, listen, 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 no, listen, 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 listen. When playing the very first card during your activation, you don't need to fulfill any special requirements. This card doesn't have to connect to any bonuses or keys. If you, it just needs to line up, line properly with the previous card in the sequence, which will cause its bottom key to join. So it's the bottom key is the only thing that would make any difference to it. Um, check if any attribute like you can make the connections. Okay. But when you're starting a new round, the only thing that the, as long as the bottom connect the, the bottom will connect automatically, I, so you can play any card to start at this point. Right. Yeah, that's still the best one. So I understand that. I'm just saying, like, if if the next one that you had had the ability to chain and this one didn't, that one you know it would have been worth it to put in the other order. Do you get what I mean? Like, so you can keep chaining. Yeah. Right. Do you know what this place two charges on chosen card in the sequence? Yeah, does? if there was any cards that you, so you would you would if uh, you were able to add the charge thing ability like some of the other cards do, you okay. would be able to place charges on. on I gotcha. So. Um, this also lets me draw a card because the owl lined up. Right, so that happens automatically. All right, I'm just gonna play this one next because it's got the lightning bolt that lines up and it goes up here for free. Yep, twice. So success. Go. So success. So what'd you get? Lose well, you one. Have to gain a pair, right? That happens yep. You're right. So I gain a terror, but then the success is I lose a terror. Okay, and? Can I, that's it. Oh, okay. That's the only reward. Could I have done it without gaining the terror? Nope. Sure couldn't have. Alrighty. Well, uh -huh. good job, Joe. Good call. So I defeated it. Oh! Oh! That was painful. Those temptations. It was. It was me trying to break off my heroin addiction. <laughs> my mushroom addiction. Oh, boy. Matt, you didn't eat the maggots with me, did you? No, he didn't. Yeah. I used my snare. Alrighty. Yeah. You go down one tear when you rest. So. Unless you're like me and you're not that measure. 
Um, the rest of this turn. I do. Um, however, I can play Pathfinder in this game. What is this one? It's just Pathfinder. Oh, there you go. Just means you find paths. Oh, I just random you're paths. I found a path. Oh, Where's the lead? Okay. I don't know. I can just find them. I don't know where they go. It's like a tracker. Yeah. I'm gonna I'm gonna spend two energy, and I'm going to heal you one, Joe. Oh. Oh, look at that. Dang, I didn't know that was an option. That's well, yeah, you're. My healing herbs. My I could spend power. four energy and craft an item. Look at the top three random items. Yeah. Wow. Why aren't you making us a hammer? Because that's my whole entire turn. So it might be worth it. Alright, so now we're back to whoever so wants to go next. Yeah, now we're back around to everybody's fresh turns. Let's go to Warrior's Fair, Josh. Okay. I'm fine with that. Okay. Uh, are you spending your energy, or are you making Matt spend two? <laughs> yes, Matt spend two. <laughs> Matt will just leave you behind, I'm sure. Alright, so, I, so we can explore then? Exploring 107? Yeah, that'll be my last energy. That's your last energy? Yeah. Okay. Um, oh, I, I, I got so red. We're exploring at 107. 107. Whitening. The hole is here, as always, gaping right in the middle of whitening. The white lichen that gave this town its new name seemed to grow out of it. Lichen. It, lichen. it covers the walls of the nearby halls with a thick coat. Only close up one can discover it is, in fact, a layer of small, sparkly crystals. Like sea salt on the wooden post of a pier. As you inspect it, several people watch you suspicious, suspiciously. If you have the Fails Legacy status, we don't. Okay. If you have the Winds of Weirdness status, we don't. If you're playing Aeli, yeah. Or she's in your party, go to verse 13. Give it to me. If you don't have any parts of the Remedy status, we don't. Go to verse 1. <laughs> If you don't have any parts, okay. A pale, toothless man grabs you by the wrist. You coil back like a spring, raising your weapon, but freeze. Hey, old man! <laughs> but freeze, seeing his pleading eyes. I know you, he says. You're the ward of the priestess from Knocked. Please, you need to help us. Many are sick. It spreads like wildfire. I beg you, come. You shudder. The education you received from Niente was rudimentary. But you know that many plagues can be cannot be cured with herbs or simple magic, magical concoctions, and that the overzealous healers often become the first victims of outbreaks. Do you visit the sick regardless, or refuse? I visit him. Okay, we'll go to verse three. You can choose not to, though. Hmm. You, could, you could choose not to. Uh, you, you'll go. go with him. Yeah, you're. You know, like we're going together is my point. Right, you could choose not to go. Oh, really? Sure, because we. I believe that we could. I believe that you could. I thought once you start exploration, you're in it together, unless like you can't oh, pay yeah, for yeah. something. Right, right, right. But I, but I, <clears throat> I wonder. I wonder. I guess we have to do it this yeah. together. Yeah. Okay. All right, yeah. They have gathered them in a long dark hall, rows upon rows of straw mattresses. Children, women, young, and elderly all share this one overcrowded space. They also share the symptoms: pale skin, black gums, loose teeth. Bleeding sores all over the body and white blotches on the skin. Is the whitening eating us too? One of the women asks. Please tell us. You shake your head. There's no disease or magic at work. Only severe malnutrition compounded by the lack of sunlight and a contagion, contagious fungal infection. Choose your cure. Show them some herbs and roots that could provide them the nutrients. Pay three energy. Um, Dang. Perform healing rites that will restore their health, at least for a short while. Pay one energy and one magic. Give them enough food to recuperate. Pay one energy and two food. Or leave for now. What was the first one? Four energy? Three energy. Three energy. I'll do the one that's one magic and one. One magic, one energy? Yeah. Okay. Gain part two of the remedy status. And go to verse two. Oh, okay, we gotta line up these skulls for a secret. Let's see if I can do it right this time. <laughs> do it correctly. Four. I don't believe Yeah, are you sure it's not one? Three. 
one one one. Wait, four what? three four. Four three four. Are yep. You sure. Four three four. Okay, good. Joshua's question. The problem is solved, at least for now. Residents of Whitening search their homes for the last remaining valuables with which to pay you. Family heirlooms, wedding bands, sacred talismans. Should you accept? Each party member gains one experience. Cool, so we gain experience. Well, so should you accept? So you da, 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 da. Then gains either two wealth or two rep. Oh, then gain, so that we don't, we don't gain this each. Then gain either two rep wealth or two rep exploration ends. So we get to choose between rep or wealth. There's two. Well, we need wealth for the... Let's do two, one wealth each. Okay. Oh, I have wealth! Thank you, thank you. Yeah, yeah. Maybe I should take the reputation. Like, wow, I can't believe you accepted their ma their <laughs> wedding bands. <laughs> Aliel. Or, um, we needed I, it to I, get I, this land safe. I mean, come on. Doc. I need good reputation, though, because I'm the only druid. I don't want to get burned in a... No, you... you, you <laughs> you're you, a I, druggy druid. I, I'm pretty hey, sure you're you the need that I, wealth I, to buy I, drugs. I, that's the reason I'm I survived. Sure caused all this issue. That's the reason I survived. I was, like, crapped out on my mushrooms one morning yeah. when they all burned all the druids. <laughs> I was done with the meth <laughs> that house. That guy can't be... That guy can't <laughs> be a can't druid. Be a Look at how high he is, yeah. man. There's no uh, way. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> As all junkies do, you sounded like eh, like no. you were getting choked. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I didn't read our flavor text. Oh my gosh. Oh, With what everything that has happened on the island, skilled warriors have become a currency of their own. Alright, so um, that was both of our turns, yeah, that was right? All so, of our turns, so, do you guys want to go again? or? Yeah. What are you doing? Well, I'm going to explore. Josh, you're joining him on this exploration. Nope, he's moving. Alright, you're exploring alone. Warriors Fair. The sea of tense bustles with the sounds of combat and haggling. Though you can't help... Did you use your energy? Yeah. I did. Okay. But you can't help but notice that even this festival has grown smaller since last year. It's a strange place. On, a, on one side, lords and rich merchants from all over the island. On the other, young men trying to prove themselves in combat and earn a contract. Or a rare lone warrior looking for a new master. Do you want to learn about the Canucks? How would you pronounce their city? The middle one? Canucks yeah. champions in their expedition take part in the grand tournament uh, explore yeah yep yeah, okay explore the city of tents or buy a contract and try to sell it for a profit and you have to have one wealth to do that uh, I'm gonna compete in the tournament Ooh. take part in the grand tournament one character only requires no deal breaker status which you don't have we don't have right? right go to verse two you step into a wait, 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 wait. requires it requires no and then it's got deal breaker in quotes okay. in bold okay. yeah okay. so it's okay. yeah okay which is weird that they because the next one says only if you don't have the helping pans is there one that's no deal breaker on there just make sure it's not labeled that No deal breaker. Okay. 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 Yeah, we have. You step into a sand-covered ring surrounded by a wooden fence. Avid gamblers and prospective contract buyers, you nod to your enemy. The rules are simple. You strike until your opponent yields or is unable to do even that. The blades are blunt, but each contestant knows a simple truth. The more enemies left maimed, and the less competition for high-paying contracts. <laughs> All right, so we have a great encounter of the Lone Squire. So we have to resolve that. Oh, look at that. He's right on the bottom. He has seven hits. He wasn't quite in the bottom. Oh, whoops. Okay. No. What, what, what are the he chances of that? right in that area right there. Uh, Grand Counter, if at any point you have two or fewer health left, the fight is interrupted and you lose. Okay. So you can't die. In a land of abandoned castles and decimated nobility, many squires lack someone to knight them. Knight them. This horse is pretty jacked. Yep. Everything in this place is pretty... Remember to turn this way, Matt, when you're talking. Because your way. mic is on your one shoulder, <laughs> and not in the middle. Love you. It's fine. Alrighty. So I'm just lining these up to see where they go. Combat. <laughs> Would have been only one of us anyways. <laughs> yep. I wanted to go back to the middle to dream in the middle. Good idea, because it did say we should 
end our thing there to dream. So. It's also automatically. But that was round one's mission. We have a new mission. I think it will still probably be help unless it's just like, oh, you dream of a mini or nearby <laughs> you know what i mean like yeah I, yeah i have no idea what could happen right like once a mission is succeeded is it like just who cares about it anymore showing that you for it i think everything kind of compounds in this i believe so probably not you put it there and you put that's the magic being paid for this is the actual okay. this is how much you've done to it you need seven cheese so okay. so what else you got Well, that, that, that wouldn't be bad. If and I was thinking about down. next turn inspecting. Uh, see what we need there. See if it's cheaper. Yeah, that's a good okay, idea. So we, do we still have to do that, which yep. is find one of these two. It might be. So well, we found, we found that one. So then does that one have. And one we know we need to activate it. Color. Correct. Yep. That, uh, so. yep. But we have to activate it for it to. You one of those? You do. Okay, yep. You know what we forgot to do? And then that lets you draw a card. Oh, no, never mind. Nope, there's no arrow. Activate them in here. Yep. Yeah, yeah exactly. we have to activate to, to end the mission. Have to or the chapter. Yeah. There's 15 yeah. chapters, that's it. So. Yeah. This one won't let me do. Okay. I can't play any of those, right? Uh, nope, so you hold on to those. Okay. So then now, so now you're uh, ending your combat thing. So, oh, wow, so you just so end the gonna, chapter after so you, you activate three it? over here. Three is uh, two might, damage there. There's one more. Right? Okay. Um, so However, there's a part six. This one so that's what it says to go one to. Of those okay. for well, every that might tell us to do one last thing or something. Damage received. So this will actually gain two more there. Nice. But I gain two damage. Yep, you do gain two damage. Yep. Okay. All right. So now that's up to five, right? Uh, which doesn't change anything because it didn't do any more. Um, and then, oh, defensive. We forgot to look at what defensive does. That makes a difference. Yeah. Uh, Defensive. Each first combat card of the activation slot adds it's one, one damage less. less. So, so, one off. so one off. Yeah. Well, it would have made a difference because it would have been two instead of three. So that would have changed what that was. So we would add two there to begin with when we got to this point, uh, which means it would have done one damage to you, and you would have lost one. So it. So you take one less damage. One got added, but we lost one because it moved one from there. So now you start. So now that's the end of its retaliation. Now you get to discard down to three. Yep. And then draw one card if you. Right. And the first one doesn't matter. The first one doesn't have to. It can line up with this. You can yeah. use it to go off of there, but it doesn't have to. The free slot always lines up essentially on the bottom. Yeah. So well, I don't have a magic. But <laughs> I don't have double board either. Right, but it doesn't matter. You would still be able to do that for one. Well, I draw one card. Yep. And so it does one damage. Yep. Doesn't want to draw a card. Yep. Hmm. Custom magic. Damn, I want custom magic. You need magic. Obviously, you need magic. Yeah. Come on, dog. Get some magic. Yeah, You're no, not you just a plain old in, farmer. Either that, or you need to move stuff in and out of your deck that maybe gives you more options than yeah. custom magic. That's cool. You can kind of customize your character to not be like a magic yeah. user. That one you yeah. can't either because the, the gold one doesn't. I can spend one. two no. energy to so gain that's a magic. That's all you're gonna do on that one. Up to four. So that max. did. So okay. So so, he's at four. so he's at four. Or I can just take so my whole entire next turn and create. So there's two damage to you. We need, for you. We need so one magic per person. Plus one extra for him. Actually. Yeah, one health, that one wealth. So we need four wealth. Four health. So was three. So it's gonna do either way. Twelve energy. Yeah. Does two damage to you. And four magic. Five magic. Yeah, which two. I have no magic. How much do you have? Two? Two, but I can spend Straight a turn, three. like yep. a sp ten, spend yep. an entire day just banking magic up. If which I is probably to. what we're going to need to do. Yeah, but I can't get the fifth one. I can only get up to four. Which we're going to buy magic at. I don't know if you can. Maybe this spot. Maybe. You want the gold ones there because you want to be able to yeah, line those no up. Because this is rad. So those should be your seconds and thirds. Yeah. This is wealth. That one over yep. there. Or nope, this is. You put that one down. That's that one heal. has several things you heal. can play off of. This is trade. Right. Yeah. For right. food for wealth. Food no, for I'm wealth. Saying that one being your first one. No, I, I know. So I rep, I wealth, just, I don't have any health. Magic, so this is pointless. Sure. So it's fine. This is gain first. two food. That's true. Draw one green and counter. And it's a times three at the bottom. Which I need to do as well because. I only have one food left. Snake or 
no, maybe no. I come and meet you up there or something. Which does make that that makes Next that actually a round because I'm right here. You don't want to play off of that mm -hmm. card either. Why couldn't I do three damage? No, because you have to have one oh, of the, I have to have the gold. yeah you have to have a gold to to keep going. So just that's to help you because I'm I don't know how you are in combat. Combat. Right. <laughs> either the rat was easy enough but because only had four hit points no no it goes off at the end no 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 hold on that goes off at the wide end because that middle stays open so yeah that yeah exactly that's a special card yeah special card Yeah, you're not going to be able to. But remember, when you put down your second card, you're going to get to draw a card right away. Yeah. Loudest ringtones ever. So I'll play that first. Hello? Yep. Playing. Yep, bye bye. You nope. can't play. You already played one card this turn, right? No, no he hasn't played any cards. Oh, this okay. Turn. All right. So that would still do two damage, though, right? It'll do two damage, yes. Well, plus, I have a bear, so it'll be three. Three damage. Yep. She prevents the first one, so it does two. Yep. Yep. Play this one so that I can draw a card. No, I can't do that one, Steve. Yeah, it has to have a lightning bolt lined up. What does the thing at the bottom happen? Does that happen automatically? No, if yeah, it's that a skull, that's, that's when they do like their attack thing. Gotcha. Which right. I had a skull. Now that one will happen automatically. Yeah, that one you don't want to. The one with the double heads, you don't want to use that one. Off. Now this one right away happens. This happens. He, you can't play that though, can he? What? It does, he doesn't have oh, a lightning no, bolt on it. Gold, it you have, have to have a lightning bolt to play more than one. Yeah, you have to play, have a lightning like, bolt. Like, you have to have a lightning bolt on the second or third or whatever card well, you're playing. Yeah. <laughs> I know. It's just, yeah. I just need a second to think. Take your time. All right. Let's go ahead and hand. I already played that, so that's what we're going to go with. And I can do that, but it's not going to let me do anything. Keep playing. Huh? Well, that might be what you need, though. Have you ever thought about pulling all your old coax out? I don't know which one's what, what is, though, is what the is problem. The what do you mean? I don't know which one's actually going no, to our one. Which internet, which one's going to our cable, satellite. I would have started do you have a dish somewhere? Yeah, the dish is in the because back of the house, the satellite's all the way up front. Could, the only reason why I'm saying that mm. I the cable is because then you is your internet? To, to play off of oh, your internet's cable. cable. Well, yeah. That did, but they brought yeah. that in directly into that room, didn't they? No, I, I want to end in this. I don't think so. Damage. I don't know where. Yeah, but if you had enough to kill it, I wasn't here. Can you do that much? No, I'll, I'll stick with Did we drill it up into that room though? Yeah. Through the floor? Yeah. Yeah, and I'll and I have to end with that, which yeah. is fine because it'll prevent two. It used to be in your room when I moved yeah. it. And then put the symbol thing on it. Sure. So you can just back that. I was just thinking. Um, so it doesn't matter to me. I was right now. Yeah, I'd love to so clean up, but again, I don't know which cable is going to the dish. And I was just thinking, Ed, because I know you were talking about doing a uh, right. drop ceiling in here or whatever. The, yeah. yeah. Down to three. Yep. All right. then I don't know if that's still your plan or whatever. To draw a Bathroom first. Okay. Down here. And yeah. Once you and then this goes away, and you get to draw. I love to. Okay. Cool. I should just like take some of my money when I get extra because that happens all the time and like build a wooden box around these uh, and put the drywall up that. start drywalling that in but did you defeat him no problem yeah it's hard because you have to frame it all out and everything yeah and what do you use two by four as a frame i think you yeah. have to follow code so yeah, you would have two to by fours, yep. not sure how that actually i don't know how that would work since it's not structural if you could just do two by twos instead of two by fours Right. Good point. So I'm then it's sure. not as coming well, down. What do you need to do? So why not play that first one there at the top? Yeah, that one. Oh, yeah, that one. Just make a box, oh, right? And just yeah. screw it into the... And that do three damage? Yep. And I mean, you're making a C, yeah. realistically. Yeah. yeah. Okay. You're making a boat. <coughs> a taco, Joe. Okay, so that Joe. kills it. Yep. You're making so a... You'll gain two up. Are, are you no. just... If you win... Or the enemy ran away. Go to verse three. You do not get any loot for winning. Oh, okay. Sorry. 
A grim physician examines your wounds and bruises, applying pungent ointments. In the meantime, you notice a commotion among the gamblers and bookmakers. It would seem your next contender re retreated from the tournament. For better or worse, you advance straight to the final round of combat. Oh, good. The next contestant is a seasoned veteran of the fair. I might die. With many contracts under their belts. Gain two health. Resolve the seasoned warrior gray encounter. Does this get shuffled back in, Joe? It will once he's... It'll go on the bottom. It'll go on the bottom, yeah. What was it again? Seasoned warrior. Oh, it won't die, though. It'll stop when I get two health. Oh, will it? You think so? For that guy, I did. There you go. Seasoned warrior. He is faint. I don't know what that means. Faint. Um, damage and stuff can't pre be prevented in any way. Okay. Uh, if you have any point you have fewer than two health, the fight is interrupted and you lose. Beware of old men in professions where most men die young. That's true. The special power is feint. So, um, in step three, damage in step three can't be prevented in any way. Damage in step three cannot be prevented in any way. What's step three? Just the combat? That's, That's when three? he's attacking back. Oh, okay. He can't. You, other cards can't prevent the damage. Gotcha. That could be bad. Yeah, it's you need to do nine damage to kill him. You got this. Or you die. Maybe you should use like two experience to put more combat cards in your deck. Maybe, but there's only one and it's not that big. Uh, hey, that could be the one you drew. I have three experience. Well, same. Fourth one means you could put yeah. things out. I'm wondering if I do a double snake or if I try to do oh, like geez. spiritual. I have a lot of these in my combat. That's what deck. I'm wondering. Like, can you look and be like, oh? Yeah, why not? You, I mean, just yeah, shuffle, man. right? But you can also mulligan. You'll draw one less card, but you could mulligan to try and get a better start again. So you would actually get something because you're going to start at a distinct advantage. Did you say that you used your snare? He did. Yeah. Then it's discarded. No, no he flipped a coin. Oh, the skull is So. Hmm. Interesting. So I have no empathy. I have one card in this entire deck that requires an empathy to well, use. I have no one. None of my stuff has that on it. Well, you're looking at combat. Combat would only be on the left hand side yeah. of the board. Right, uh, diplomacy the end I don't so think I'm going to be uh, diplomatic at all, so... <laughs> I mean, you have a pretty rough look go at it right now. And I'm angry, so I don't think I would be diplomatic, right? Yep. That's tough, man. What do you do? Do you, like, do you level up one of these? Or do you, like, do you get a card? Like The problem is, is it's a random card. Yeah, it's one of three. Yeah. The, yeah, and, I mean, some of them are decent. Where the, I mean, if you look at this one, it just does straight... Damage. Yeah. But then you also gain, like, Enrage. You gain for every boar you have, and I have two boars. So right, right there, it does. this card alone does four damage. That's... Wow. You know what I mean? Like, so yeah. it could be good if you, if you have pulled that card. Uh, but it loses one. That doesn't happen. It only happens if that's the card you end up. Oh. It's only the immediate effect that happens immediately. Immediate of immediate. Mm. Best part is they have, you can't even see what's going on. He's just laying cards on top of cards because it's so shiny over there. Yeah, why the it's so shiny on that side? Nope. Does it make nope, sense? It's the same light. light. And maybe it's closer. Yep, maybe it's angled, not as far down. Yeah, maybe. maybe it's technically yeah. this light yeah, reflecting all the way <laughs> over there. Magic lightning. Mighty ball. Magic missile. say when you get down when you automatically reach to or drop below to if at any point you have fewer than two the fight is interrupted and you lose okay. so 
So you actually technically could get killed. Just go down to three. Or get knocked down. Yep. One. yep. How much more damage do you need to do to him? Two. Oh, you got this. You can try. You got this. What happens if is there an escape thing or yeah, a run away? That, because that's a double board, oh, double so thing. So yeah, you, you, know, you want you want to do something else if you can help them. Well, that would also that would let you draw a card though. That yeah. One, yeah. What the hell? Why is it only on? Oh. Yeah, right. but that, that would let you continue. That's an automatic bonus to anything, so that wouldn't be bad. And then you know? do you have another lightning bolt one that deals damage? Uh, no, I only have a uh, magic lightning bolt. Yeah, I'll, I'll, I'm gonna lose this turn. Are well, you gonna Are you gonna die this turn? Well, I can do, well, you do that, and then you get to draw a card. That could That could save you. Yeah. Because you can play that. Yeah. And that'll still do one. Damage, that one let you do two. <laughs> that one will one. let him do one. He no, because I don't have double bore. Doesn't matter if it, it still does one. Though. Yeah. It still does the one at the. No, bottom. I understand. I'm saying I don't have double bore. That's why it doesn't do two. Right, but it oh, lets you draw a card. Oh, it does let you draw a card. Yeah. Yeah. And then you do have this one. And then you might be able. Well, that you need magic for that. Yeah. So, you can't so do that. As, if hopefully I. Play this and I'll play draw a lightning. Yeah. Lightning bolt! So I'll play that, which okay. does one damage. Yes! Draw a card. No? Oh. Well, I can play this regardless, but that doesn't help me. Mm. I don't know. How do you escape? I can't escape, right? Yeah, you can escape. You can choose to escape, but that's just. What's the do. opportunity? Lose two and then remove the last card. So you can escape and he does no damage. Because they take your, their opportunity attack if you... Right. How much dam? What's he going to do to you, though? At how much damage he's at? Yeah, so it'd be two damage that would, kill, that would knock him to zero. I'd put me at one. Oh. I wouldn't die, but I'd be out of the turn. Two damage? Two damage would kill you. It'd put you to zero. Oh, I'm at one now. Yeah. yeah. Well, you're at two. It's at two. Yeah. But you would okay. lose two hit points, right? So. Yeah. <laughs> So you, you probably so if you don't want to go to the dying section you probably want to yeah, choose well, the escape play this, thing but that doesn't do anything because I can't play anything after that. Oh, it does let you escape for no opportunity, yeah, no opportunity attack. attack. Yeah, so I mean, but well. that really doesn't do anything anyway. <laughs> guess, but why the opportunity is lose that crap? Right, but if you're running away, then the battle's over. Right, so I guess it. Well, what it does, what the reason why that would be important is, is if other people were in combat with you yeah. as well, then it wouldn't, then then it wouldn't prevent that from going. Okay, away. So can you better. can you play the one card that lets you draw a card and no. then? No, he already played all the cards that let him draw. That was that one. Gotcha. He's got one, but it requires magic, and he doesn't have any magic. Gotcha. Left. Yeah. Not, well, now I know this character could use magic for that, not extra damage. Well, yeah. <laughs> okay. So what happens? Uh. So he's gonna lose that one. So oh man! I was really close. Yeah. So are you losing or are you? He's oh, gotcha. Use. You're escaping. If you lose or escape, exploration ends. Okay. Gotcha. So that goes in the bottom. I can't. I can't. There's no way I can heal enough to do that again. No. Not quick, anyways. <laughs> there it is. Um. All right. So th is that everybody's turn again? Josh went. I went. Just you, no, just them went. Okay. So me and you, I am exhausted, almost exhausted. I'm one away from exhausted. You so have are you food, or? though, don't you? I have you one food, one yeah. Food. You don't have any? I don't have any, so I got, I'm going to have to move and do that. So I'm going to move to uh, here. Okay. Yep. And that's one for those. I should probably just pass. I'm having a rough what day. What happens if you reach zero on energy? Nothing. You okay, just no, you only go, go up four. four and so you okay. Yep, I pass. Right, but for someone with me with such low health point, it's fine to do so. It yeah. make a difference. Yeah, it doesn't change much. You're going to gain one health later, but that's how you're going to gain it. Okay, so I'm going to pass. Yep. I, I, I have not. I, okay. Well, you guys have. I did my turn. Are you guys passing, Josh? Yeah, I don't yeah, know if you I, were. Yeah, I'm passing. Yeah, I'm, not. I'm actually going to do you're something else. You're not passing? Else. Okay. Uh, so so it's back to here. you two then. Yep. Okay. I'm just going to steal your dreams. And I'm going to. Get out of my dreams. I'm going to spend two in... Oh, 106 is open. No, it's not. Yep. Oh, yeah, it is. No, it is. There it is. It is the... Uh, Matt, you should explore that mounds. since you don't care about going to zero. With the former masters of the island gone, no one is left to guard their burial treasures. Hopefully. And then... Uh, oh, treasure hunt. 
for two energy, you can gain one in uh, terror, spend one, uh, and one wealth, and roll a die. If the result is six, go to verse four. Wow. Um, Secret verse four? For 112. Oh, for 112. Right. Or, I'm sorry, 106. I thought. Yeah. Um, this is also a place with dreams and also a place where uh, a man her could be. Yeah. All right. So I'm going to actually go here. Uh, so this was, and this is, uh, in ages past, only the Druids were allowed into the grove for good reason. That is now forgotten. Forgotten. Uh, all right. So I'm going to use my last two energy there. Okay. And I'm going to gather food. So I'm going to gain two food, but I also have to draw a green encounter. encounter. Oh, it's a rat. You will see no arrows. Plus, there's technically three. Hmm? Just, yeah, there's means, more it just means it's a safe place. Yeah. yeah. Um, it's a okay. friendly so village. Yeah. Kill the rat! Uh, kill the kill rat! The kill rat. the rat! Kill the kill rat! Kill the rat! Kill the rat. Okay. He's gonna die. <laughs> Do a rat! He's got plenty of hit points. Just run away. No, you can get more food, I think, if you kill it, right? Potentially. We just need health and wealth. Health, wealth, and magic. Yeah. About that. But you gain magic over here, Joe, right? Nope. You gain terror. Terror and wealth. Yeah, we still don't know where to gain magic at. You. You just have to gain it. I can't gain past four, though, and we need five. Can anybody else gain magic? And we need. So maybe we have to do the other one then. Maybe once we there, find there are, this. There are places on the board where we'll have opportunities to gain magic. Right. Like well, things that we'll find or whatever, you know, like that. Or stuff we investigate. Um, hmm. Gonna have to go and do some stuff. You can go back here and talk to them again, and the whispers give you magic. You still can't gain above four, though. Didn't Steven gain, gain a magic during that? They both did, I think, yeah. I forgot which one it was. No, I can gain above four. I just, my ability can't, won't let me gain above four. Yeah. All right. Okay. I'm going to go here like this. I forgot which route that was to get there, though, defend, to get the magic. Which doesn't do you did much the ear. on its own. Huh? But then you listen to him. That's I'm right. going to do... Entangling Trap, um, which lets me draw two cards. Okay, that's a little better. Uh, so it's Why two cards? Oh, because the two times. Two yep. Yeah, two times. Yeah, okay. Bang, bang! So bang, wow! Draw those cards! Bang, wow! That allows you another card up top. Bang, nope, bang. I don't have any aggression, so that won't mm. actually allow me to What you looking at? I've seen which I have doubles of the most to see what would be most beneficial to upgrade. Yeah. With my stock deck. Yeah. Oh, with your stock deck? Oh, that's a good idea. Yeah. Problem is, is some of them cost, would cost six experience, Matt. Okay. Um, yeah. The only one you could do for four would be the bottom one, which is snakes. Uh, I was thinking about snakes anyway. All right, works. so... Um, instead of resolving uh, the enemy attack, um, lose one off of it, but there was none to lose, and then uh, discard this last card, so that card gets discarded. Okay. Um, and then on uh, to my new round, discard the three, draw a card. Right. Did you take a one because it was zero to two damage? No, he that's, that's, that card instead gets discarded. Instead of the oh, enemy gotcha. attack, lose one and do that. This is an entangling trap. That I set down for it. All right. Um, yeah, we need magic for sure. All right, so I'm going to do this one here, which will do three damage, and uh, nice. get to draw a card. Double kill. And then do it, Steve. Kill him. Do it. Try and do. There's the magic. I'm so close to uh, my guy. I know. 
I was, yeah. I was really excited. There was like three verses you read after that if you did it. Seems like you uh, draw a lot of cards and do a lot of damage there, sir. Yeah, yeah, that's, yeah. I don't know if we heal up when we're done. Yeah. It literally says like record everything of your character. I'll do this I'll one, I think. What? I don't think we heal up in between like chapters. Maybe. Maybe not. Because it says when you save, you like record everything about your character. Obviously, I'm going to need a notepad for this game. Um, it has a. The front sheet, I think. Is no, I meant just in general to keep a nice history of everything. Gotcha. Yeah. Not that I'm good at writing stuff. I can barely read That's my your own. journal. I yours can, journal. I can barely read my own handwriting. Be yours journal, Josh. That's what it is. The taint cup. The tainted cup. The taint not, cup. Not, not tainted cup. The taint cup. Okay, the, uh, that's where you wear it for safety. Or you can drink it and it just might taste funky. <laughs> Ugh, tainty. <laughs> Cheese flavored. That tastes like formanda. Actually, no. I want to read this maggot right. thing. Um, I think dude, everybody should read theirs. They're really neat. I lose one. Oh. Draw a card. Who's your from? Don't tell me that. Efferine. Oh, mine's for something different. Foremaster of uh, Canot. That's from Lord Yvain. That and then I'll do two damage and kill it. So I kill it, I gain a food. Uh, there you go. Actually, I kind of know where I should explore it next, though, I think. The one specific right there. Right? Oh, yeah? Yeah. <clears throat> um, okay, so that was the end of my turn. Okay, so everyone else has passed. Or, uh, no, not Matt, not Matt, not Matt, not Matt. Yep. Should explore. Why you can't do it with me? No, that's fine. Then we can find out wh what what powers this manure. Nope, false. That's that is not thing. an explore. That's a different action. That's but he could. You could have done that for free. That's zero. Yeah, you could do that for free mm. too if you wanted to. Yeah, let's inspect the manure for free. Okay, that's at 101. 101. 102. 101. 101. It is the local manure is weathered and cracked. It requires special attention. It requires all characters. The menu's right secret card and the stone shaper's tools secret card. Pay two. One second, what card? Stone shaper's tools. Okay. Two energy. Two health. Two wealth. Two magic. Per player. Hint, the menu in your home town will be beyond your help for quite some time. Other nearby menus are easier to activate. Okay. Okay. No, okay. All set? Alright, so who's dreaming first? 102, Josh? Or no, 101, I mean? 101. Are you dreaming or are you, you crying? You nightmaring? I'm dreaming. Dreaming because you're not in that. In your restless dream, a pale lady rises from the water. Her eyes milky and her skin spoiled with rot. She whispers something into your ear. Her breath smells of sea salt, kelp, and rotten fish. Mm. You barely remember the words. There was something about three enigmas. One hidden under the Isle of the Dead. One clutched in the grasp of burned you know, hands. I want to write this stuff down because this is probably real. What, what are those things? One hidden under Isle of the Dead. The Isle of the Dead. One under Isle Dead. Yep. I don't write stuff. One clutched in the grasp of burned hands and arms, hmm. which is probably what I got already. Probably what you got already. And one, one buried one. in a mist-covered mound. <clears throat> That's yeah. what it sounds like to me. But what could it mean? <laughs> Hint! <laughs> the dream refers to three out of eight locations surrounding Kanat. It's possible some of them are not yet revealed. They're all revealed! They're all revealed! All right, so... Down doing that one. We have not. We have not. We have not done that one. We're still on three, so that has not. <laughs> that should be down at least one. It's if at that's two, two, which is correct. Yeah, it's at two. Okay. Yep. The, the middle one's at three. Yep. Yeah, so, yeah. all right. So, who's next number? You guys. Uh, one or two. Hunters Grove. You're both dreaming. Yeah. If you have part two of the morning song status. We don't. Okay. 
You drift off under this okra painted constellation into a restless sleep where you chase a young dove in the hills just outside Connaught. You wake early in the morning in a cold sweat with several fresh cuts. The taste of blood fills your mouth. Beside you, raw pieces of meat lay carefully wrapped in leaves. If you don't have the hunter's mark status, do. We don't. Each character in this location gains two food. Then gain the hunter's mark status. Wow. Wow. I'm 107. Uh, we we way did this out of order. Really? Well, yeah. We don't dream first. We should have done food, <laughs> give up food. Yeah, you're right. Yeah, yeah. Let's stuff. do all that. I'm, well, I was excited to dream. Yeah. All right. Food. So I give up my food, and what happens? You you go up one health, and you, you lose one. Lose one terror, and except you for me. fill back yep. up or go up four. <laughs> Yep, so then go back up to full or go up to four. One, two, yep. three, four. Reduce all the time dials. So this goes down to one, which looks like a four. This goes down to two. So if we don't, don't get another menu yeah. for the next three rounds. Yeah. Right. Um, it gets removed and all the cards start to fade away. If, and we if take that's like, the only one, then, we, then it's a little bit different, like like with that one being the only one left there's some there's some negatives until we get one relit e either one relit or a new one up we'll take like damage every turn and pretty much be dying very quickly it's, it's a lot of damage yeah. cool. it's like two damage and two in terror yeah in the campaign early yeah, yeah. Um, what's so the, then it's reveal uh, the next event card hold on hold on oh hold no on. we're in it and I'm sorry advance, yeah, advance your character by spending experience I have three experience yes I am going to advance my character because I have one practicality and no spirituality, so I'm going to give myself one spirituality. Okay. So that what? I have enough. He's advancing his character. Three? For two. Oh, two. Uh, no, for three, because I have one point in it. It costs four. Oh, yeah. Yeah, four experience for the second point in an attribute pair. Oh, okay. I thought it was the, for the first. Okay, I mis nope. miscounted. Never mind. Never mind. Alrighty. Never mind. Never mind. Okay, um. Okay, um, yeah, so then, uh, yeah, so then we would be under the dreamings. So that was the end of our dream, right? The Hunter's yep. Grove dream? Uh. All right, so then this whitening dream. Yep, okay. That's you. Dream. You gotta flip coins. Yeah, I do, you're right. Hey, I get a dream. Yeah! Get it, Joe! Oh, we, somebody already did this one already. You dream of your home. Your dream of your home is understandable considering for the first time in your life you've wandered so far from it, but why is everyone talking and walking backward? Okay. Good. It could have been a nightmare, though. Could have. Yeah. yeah. Might have been awful. Probably. Probably. Just about everything's awful. Yes. Um, <laughs> okay, so then we start the next day. Yep. So remove the expired mentors and spare locations. Yep. Uh, yep. Reduce all time. Did that. Done. Reveal the next event card. All right. Random events. Okay. Unnatural chill. If you're out of a settlement, when the end of the day starts, you lose two health. Okay. Cool. Water freezes and grass covers with frost. Old people call it the four dweller curse. So if you're know. not at a settlement? Is that an unnatural so there's, chill there's event? Only two settlements. Right. What? Is that an unnatural chill event? It is. No, oh, I'm protected from that. Nice. <laughs> Look so at you and your adventures, kid. <laughs> it's about time. Yeah. All right. Do you have to discard it to use that? No, it just no, says no. ignore the no, effects of heavy rainfall or unnatural chill um, events. Okay, so that was the event card. Move guardians. They didn't have any. Uh, pick your active item or seeker cards if you have more than enough. And then we start on to our normal actions. For Did you spend your food for healing and stuff? No, yeah, I did. I gained the two. I gained the extra because remember we gained extra. Or I gained extra because in the Hunter's Grove we gained two extra. He perks. gained two and then gained an extra two. Right, and but he, he had zero and he still has four left. I had no. I had. I ended up with. I got. You had five. I think. Five. Okay. Yeah, yeah. I had five. Yeah. Okay. No. Yeah. So who's doing what? Um, I know I want to. Explore I'll just move. Grove. Yeah, I got an extra one from killing the green. You thing. will have to do a gray encounter when you go there. Yep, let's do it. All right. I wanted to do something. Yep, sure. all right. It is a grave robber. 
it's a fight. So uh, he is a fast robber. So fast means. What do we have the cards so you can start? Yeah, there you go. Players so can play a maximum of two combat cards per activation. And robber means when all characters drop to one or less health, they lose all wealth and discard all items. Then the encounter ends. So how do I how do I kill him? All right, so you need to do seven damage to him yep. overall. You can only do two cards at a time, so you're going to be a little bit more limited than we've been mm -hmm. in some of our combos, but that doesn't necessarily mean that you're not. But you're a battle master. Uh, I yeah. don't know about that. We'll see. Battle master. Battle so master. Cards. Uh -huh. I am the master of battle. And the since you have both of those symbols, uh -huh. you can match either uh -huh. one of those. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. What? So I'm assuming like this one, I would have to spend a magic to do that. Yes. <laughs> gotcha. Well, you, you would only do one half of it. This is just saying that it's got a magic leading in and a magic leading out. Gotcha. You but but it would be this, so I would have to spend a magic to do that. To get that extra bonus, yes. Gotcha. Yep. Oh, okay. Did you take this one down too? Yes. yes. Cool. And you can go rob him again. Huh? Or we might have enough wealth to buy him. Though. <laughs> we need the wealth for. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> the main objective. <laughs> Should but be we, able to play but we could cards. buy a hammer. <laughs> yeah, in theory. He might not even sell it to even if we offer him the mount, right? So it goes on this side, right? Yep. So it goes there. Yeah. So you got one connection at the top, which gives you one. Yep. And, and then one at the bottom, so that's yep. two damage. So, yep, there's two. <coughs> and hey, then the none of this happens right away because you don't, because you're not ending here. Okay. If you chose to end there, you could be, but. Gotcha. Right. Hmm. Now you. Don't have you do have two of that, so you could technically combo off of there if you gotcha. wanted to now, or you could combo off there the other way. Kind of depends on which is the better choice. I was just thinking how things line up at the bottom, because right. then I couldn't play this one, because or could I? No, that would still block that one. Yeah, so. So I'd have to play this one, but it doesn't really do anything. Right, it, which is fine, yeah, and then you'd play that one. Well, that yeah. does less than if yeah, it plays off of this one. Fight. Right. What do you mean? So here's the thing. When this winds up, right, it bonuses there and it bonuses here. But if you play it off of here, it also does an extra damage because it lines up with that. Gotcha. But, but if I play, play this. You can't play a third card, though. I can't play a third card. Oh, that's yeah, that's true. That's true. Okay. So I would play this. So what's the ability? Flip well, over one weapon or shield uh -oh. you're uh -oh. using to gain two yeah. damage. This item is inactive until the end of wow. combat. Okay. So I would just gain one and a card? No, nope. that just that, allows you to play a second card. Gotcha. Right, right. You, you, right, it would gain one more damage. Well, see, now you might want to... Oh, yeah, you definitely want to do that. Okay, yeah, yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. I was looking at down yeah, here, because yeah, yeah, doing three is definitely better than only doing two. Yep. <laughs> okay, so um, you're at three, so what does he do? So he does one damage to you. Uh -huh. okay. You lose two of the t damage you've already done, so yeah. two damage comes back off of him. So it's just going to be a back and forth. Wow. And then this card gets discarded. So that goes into your discard pile for that, right? And then I draw one card. Uh, uh, yeah, you discard down to three, but you don't add, you already have less than three, so you draw one. Yep. Yeah. Wow. What's that time thing? You can just try to That run, means Josh. that if you end on that mo maneuver, you'd put the time counter on there, and on the next turn, you would get to take that action. So you oh. gain two extra damage. Yeah, this card does not need that. I need for the next turn. Oh, wow. That's nice. That one's not bad. That one will do three damage to her. This one, yeah. Yeah. Does the other one have a bonus thing off of it? It does. Okay, yeah. I see. But okay. it doesn't yeah, yeah, yeah. do yeah, anything. Yeah. So it's going to be this thing of I do three damage, he takes two. I do. Well, what's the four? It might not be removed damage. It's three to five. Ouch. Yeah. And you can't do a second or a. Well, this will do three damage, damage which will then make him do maybe at two damage when he's done with <laughs> it all. But, but then, then you're going to be down yeah. to one card. Or Again, which this card does no damage. You can just run, right? The actually, actually, here's the thing, though. This is also going to make you lose one energy. energy when you play it. You could also not play either card. Mm -hmm. He would do his opportunity attack, which would skip rid what's, of this. What's the tear thing mean? That means it what removes that? the last card in the de in, in the order. So what this oh. would do is, is he would... He would, you would get to draw. You would hold that card. You draw another card, and then this one would get discarded away, and you would start. Yeah, but I would start at zero. No, because he's only at one, so you just do mm. one damage to. You. Gotcha. How do you escape? Uh, escape. You choose to do the escape. Yep. 
and then he will get his opportunity attack. So in this case, all it does is it removes the last card off of the stack and tosses it so it actually not do yep. anything to you. I think he's just, you're right. You're just yeah, I think I'm just going to escape because I think it's just going to be a loop here. Yeah. It's going to be tough. It'll yeah. be tough. I'm going to escape. It is an awesome bonus because you get, get one an item. item. And oh, it could wow. be literally any one item. Yeah. yeah. But yeah. I'm going to escape. Yeah. Okay. So Run away. Yeah. Yep. So, yep. So he'll do. That was great, right? Yep. Yeah. Run away! Uh, you read my letter? This is my private backpack. Okay, you guys go. You moved. Yep, uh, I moved. I did my thing. I'm done. Moving on. You lose one energy to trigger the escape. Well, that sucks. Yep. Ah, uh, we didn't have Matt do that. Okay. What you need to do? You have to lose an energy to trigger an escape. Yep. Yeah. So we'll know for next time. He wouldn't have been able to move up and dream and gain that tube food. Yeah. It's fine. Just we'll go from it from here. We'll from ah, here. I moved. Uh, yeah. For an energy. Okay. Yeah. I was going to explore there. Do you want to do a three-way explore? We can. Well, we gotta split whatever we get. Have you guys explored there yet? No. Well, technically it would be a two-way exploration because he had moved into that, which was his action for the turn. So technically, we could explore, which would, we would split their energy for that. Okay, I was going to explore regardless, so if you want to do that thing. You guys exploring? Yeah. It's 102. 102. Use your energy. Yeah. yeah, spend your energy. Get it. it. The Hunter's Grove. It's still here as always. Enormous empty eye sockets start to watch. You as, you, as soon as you descend into the moss-covered basin, the horns as wide as a long ship are now a home for countless birds. Inside the vast skull lies a quiet, candle-lit shrine with, a, with several straw mattresses strewn about. Yeah, you're in like a giant deer's head. Take a nap. Or antelope's head. The local hunters call this ancient skull the Stag Father and lay charms and offerings around it. The legends say that the stag father takes the dreamers away to join him on a great hunt. If you don't have the tracker, do we have tracker? No, go to verse three. A trail of blood and broken branches is not usual in the sacred forest for the, of the great hunter. You almost pass it without noticing. Uh, when an imprint of, bloody, of a bloodied hand on a white birch's bark catches your attention, this prey certainly wasn't an animal. Gain the tracker status. It's vegetable. Then choose one. Follow the trail or carry on? I want to follow the trail, clearly. Then we'll follow the trail. Go to verse 5. A tangled haired, bow, <laughs> tangled haired bow maiden lies hidden deep in the briars, clenching her pierced gut. It looks like the hunter became the prey. Judging by the bow maiden's hisses and curses, there's still some fight in her. You approach regardless. Her wounds look beyond your help. There's only one. Uh, there's only one place where they can tend to injuries like this: the Island Asylum off the coast to the south. But it's a long trek to save a bloodthirsty servant of the Stag Father. Place a time token on the uh, dial and set it to two. Gotcha. Uh, this dial moves with your character model. As long as you have the dial, add one energy to each cost you pay. So that's to both of you? Yeah. So Matt needs well, one to, and I... To whomever it is. If we're in a party, then it would be... Yeah, it, it, otherwise, it would be a single one of the people. Well, that's what I'm saying. You both yeah. got one, so you both should have one, because you guys are going to do energy it's separate. Not it's not two different... It's not two different things. Essentially, they're it's carrying two, the person. Yeah, it'd be one of us. If, if we're doing this as a party, party it, costs three. it costs one extra. It's not one per. It's one extra. If we split up, then one of us has to take her and gotcha. one person is doing it. When the dial ticks down to zero, discard it. This will make the task, impo oh, the task impossible to complete. You can also voluntarily discard the dial at any time. New task. Bring the wounded, wounded bow maiden to the island asylum and explore the asylum to find help for her. Right. Oh, well, I guess, I, I guess it's kind of pointless for me to go to island asylum then. Really, yeah. You don't have the maiden. Cool thing, cool thing, guys. Steve, yep. Steve went. Yep, I Steve went. went. Josh's turn. 
Josh already went. Really if you want to meet us up in the... Josh moved? He was there. Oh, he, you're right. He did, didn't he? Yeah. So now we only get. Okay. Well, I want to end up here if I can help it for several reasons. Because then that lets me reduce some terror because I have several of those. It would also let me actual, you know, it would let me gain and whatever. And also I wouldn't have to suffer the unnatural chill. And... What are blue encounters? Those are, uh, blue are diplomacy, diplomacy yeah. every time. Yeah. And you don't want to do. Yep. Yeah. That would be super rough for you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yep. Okay. So, me, if you want me to limp along so with her, I can Me and Steve should not travel her, together. It should be one of us. Which yeah. Will, which would... We did that wrong. Uh -huh. Which will put me there with one, but then that gives you still something you else to do. You shouldn't move there, I guess. You know what That's I mean? Like, like, you don't have I didn't know, though. I know. You were going to go to the island, right? Yeah, yeah to start to explore it, because oh, yeah. it said you need like to go to the mist. I'll say, if you come up with me, we can go there together. Right. Where? Up top? top? Yeah. Do yeah. She just goes down each round, right? It, each day cycle. You can when spend. We, you can spend we, energy making magic. What's that? Cycle, you can spend energy making magic. Oh, food. So I was gonna try and do that. Yeah. yeah so I'll, I'll you can get there, there first. Which is one. But I don't know what I can do to keep my energy up and until you get there. Move along, yeah. Let's continue. Yeah. Okay. And I'm gonna stay there. Okay. So you guys did yours. You know, you'll take two damage right for being an un unnatural chill, right? No problem. Because you're not in a. Oh, that's right. If I he moves about again. If, see. Josh, if you're going to end your turn on the thing, can we trade? What? I just said if you're going to end your turn on a settlement. I mean, I have two actions left. Yeah, I, plan, I, I plan on trying to get up by Joan. Okay, I'm going to gather food. Which I get two food. Right, and you have a green encounter. Yeah. This is going to go well. Frenzied boar. Oh, look. He wants my food. It's Rush. What's Rush? Uh, first character receives two wounds. So that'll be you. <laughs> I do like these on the back. You should flip them over and show them. Like, that's cool. Yep. Yep. We certainly can. Wow, he has, like, nothing to connect to. He's got two things to connect to. What are you talking about? Right, but he can't connect with the uh, practicality side, so... I am just going to run away. I'm not even going to try it. You're not even going to try it? Nope. Interesting. All right, well... Nope. All right, so nope. he gets his opportunity to attack on you. Yep, which is discard two cards. All right, and you lose one energy. Yes. Run away. Run away! Yep. But at least I didn't die. And you gained two food. I did gain the two food. If I would have killed him, I would have gained three more food, but... Ooh, uh, that, nice. that wasn't gonna happen. <laughs> that definitely wasn't gonna happen. Literally, not a single one lined up to deal damage. Right. Well, yeah, but you can also mulligan and come back with one less, and that might have actually given you good enough to. Well, you, no, you can the mulligan board, every he, round. I mean, very first round, you can mulligan, and therefore you can come back with, you know, like with the least stuff that started to. Do you get point. three cards after you mulligan, or you just go two cards? You one less than whatever you would have the round before. Because mm -hmm. you could technically start with. You start with three, but there's ways that could end up giving you more cards. All right, Josh, your turn. That's the idea. If you're in a city, just don't move again. I want to rush to get her healed before she dies. You can do it next round. I mean, we would technically, it, because I would get, because I'll get pieces yeah. back too. You know, we could, we could technically do it in the future. Because we're, because we're going opposite, kind of. Like me and Joe are trying to go up here, and you guys are trying to go down there. Right. It does make sense for me and Steve not to travel together. Correct. <laughs> and for you two not to travel together. That way the diplomacy right. and the right. the attackers are split up. So. Uh -huh. All right. 
So you, what are you guys doing? Um, I'm trying to decide if I want to actually activate the thing or I'm possibly. I'm trying to come, Josh, and give me his adventures back. Why, hey, this. you know what? Hey, Matt, why not, instead Use of doing that, why not, why not explore Game that area magic. that we're on? I want to take damage anyways because yeah. I'm not in the town. You do that. So it's going to go down to. So yeah. be one, it'll be I won't be able piece, to have that much energy or, next well, turn anyways. Well, technically it'll be two for you, but, yeah. but still, I mean. You're getting hurt. Does it change a lot? Well, the problem is then I won't have enough energy to go here and do the thing. I only have enough I, energy to go I, there. I'll have a, I'll have a, I'll have a decent amount of energy, as far as it, don't forget we can share energy to move her along too if we stay together. Oh, I didn't know you were going to well, continue with me. Well, I'm just saying, like I would do. I'm saying if we explore this, then yeah, I would do that to go together. Okay. The only reason why I wasn't going that next step is because I didn't have the extra energy to do it. Yeah. No, yeah, and I needed to be there all seven. Let's explore here. Though. Yeah. The, yeah, okay. Hey, what's up, so Kyle? So that costs you two total. Does it? Well, Sorry. anything that costs energy costs down. one more because of her. I thought it was just moving. No, anything Dang that costs anything. energy costs one more. So it'll cost you two energy to do that, and it costs me one. I only have one. If you don't want to explore okay. with me, you don't have to. No, I'll explore with you then. I just didn't okay. think it took two. So we're doing 101. 101. Should explore. you do that, Matt? Because you're going to stop at four, whereas if you're the next one up, you would have went up more. And then you would have more turns next round to be able to get there. So do you. you don't have to if you don't want to. It'll only give you one more energy. Gotcha. Because I have such low health. A deep feeling of loss fills everything in Canucht, from dilapidated forms to the sunken eyes to of uh, those who remain in town. The manure in the market is all but extinguished, and everyone brave or resourceful enough has left to find a solution. And do we have winds of weirdness status? No. no. Do we have secret card 66? No. No. Do you have hunter's mark status? No. Okay, then choose. Visit the families of the champion... No, we do have hunter's mark. I'm sorry. Oh, we do. Okay. Verse 6. Three women mourn in front of the long hall. One of them has lost her child, a girl of eight recently butchered like an animal in the hills outside Connacht. You feel your legs giving away. The faint memories of the night hunt now burn your mind like hot iron. You stumble away, trying not to look at the mourner's face. <laughs> we got some fresh meat, Matt. Oh I don't know what that, kid's name, what that person's name was. But. If you don't have part one of the morning song status... I don't think we do. Nope. Each party member gains two insanity, or two terror. Oh. Ooh. Oh, oh, that man. was tough. Then gain part one of the morning song status and choose from the following. Okay. Visit the families of the champions from the first expedition. Ask the townsfolk to help you prepare. Rest for the day in your own home, or wander the alleys twisted by the white weirdness. Mm. Only if the Meneer model is not okay. You can't do that one. That's only if the Meneer model is not there. I'd say visit the family or rest at her home. Yeah, I'm. I, I want. I think either one of those two as well. I'm not sure which one. You know, my character's pretty adventurous, so we're gonna, um, visit the families. Okay. okay. This long winter, nearly everyone here lost a friend or a family member. First to hunger, then to disease, finally the five remaining pillars of the community, the only heroes this land had ever known, suddenly left. Now when you look into the distant eyes of the last remaining residents, you realize they want to forget. Uh, do you want to loosen their tongues with mead? Ask them to share their burdens requ requires one empathy okay. or leave. Um, Does mean require wealth? Do I not know that? Food, you, uh, pay. You can pay one wealth or food. I mean, I have the food to do it. Do we need food for one of our mentors? I will uh, I will read the rest of this. Loosen their tongues with mead. There's an old custom, a Health late night wake magic. for those who wandered far from their home. Holding it for everyone who left with the expedition won't be cheap, though. Pay one wealth or one food. Well, if it's an old custom, that seems more fitting. I mean, I, I have the food to do it. Okay, we'll do the meat. Okay. There's two. It takes a while to break the silence of the grief-stricken people, but when you do, stories of separations and departures flood you like torrential rain. You try to remember every detail, the color of a palfrey horse with village priestess, Niante Road. The ornament... Oh, yeah, yeah. The ornament on the hauberk that young Lord Yvain wore, the strange drinking horn, ear fear the smith used to lug around, the birthmark of Fail, the master huntsman, the embroidered cape of Albert, the seasoned traveler who'd seen all parts of the island. Who knows what detail can help you down the road. 
Gain part one of the fate of the expedition status. Exploration ends. Alright. Okay. Is it back to me? Yeah. To uh, I think so. Well, you do. I you already. I, I used my two to gain magic. Food. No, I did this oh. for my last one. So now now we're all around again. I'm going to pass this round. Pass. Uh, I'm passing as well. Pass. Okay. So now we go to the night fay. End of the day. Rest. Mm -hmm. Consume one food. I'm going right. to need food for next time, Joe. Okay, which uh, then give you your health back and yep. lose an insanity One, or two, lose a terror. Three, four. Yep. If you don't have enough food, we yeah. don't it. Restore to blah blah blah. Uh, advance your character by spending experience. Still a little short of that. Mm. Joe, what if you don't have enough food? Joe, you're going to take two damage. You lose all your... Yeah, that's fine. You, you, you lose you, all of your um, energy. You lose all of your energy before you would do your refill oh. and then you would go, go from there. And if you were already at zero energy, you'd lose a health. Yep. Um, anyone ad advancing characters? No. Modify decks? No. no. If your location the dream. Uh, when do we do the event, though? What? When do we resolve that? If you're out of a summon when the end of the day starts. Okay, so right. we should have lost our two health already. Okay. Well, you should have. Yeah. Yeah. Just you. That's fine. Oh. All right. Uh, the yeah, so, sure so then there's ago. Dreaming. Yeah. So Dreaming in the Hunter's Grove and Dreaming in the Canuck Barbell. Okay, Canuck, Dream. Are you, are you still all dreaming? Yeah. In your restless dream, a pale lady rises from the water, her eyes milky, her skin spoiled with rot. She whispers something in your ear. It's the three things that we whispered to Josh earlier. And nothing else? Nothing else. Okay. And then 102... And you have to flip the coin. Yeah. Would that come from my dream also? No. No. It's just You'll me. each do separately. Good. For real. Dream. Woo. Okay. Well, now it can be for both. Dream and nightmare. It's the same. Do we have part two of morning song status? Part two? No. Okay. <laughs> well, you drift off under this orc. Okra painted constellation into the rest of sleep where you chase a young dove into the hills, blah blah blah. You wake early in the morning in a cold sweat with several fresh cuts. The taste of blood fills your mouth. Beside you, raw pieces of meat lay carefully. If you don't have the hunter's mark status status. We do. We do. Then nothing happens. Cool. We don't get in the food because we have hunter's mark. So. Yeah. You didn't need it anyway. Alright. So now we go to the start of the day, right? So yeah. this is removed because it goes to zero. This game goes really long. Yeah, it does. Yep. This goes down to one. Probably not great. No. Not good. I mean, it's fine. We still have all of today and all of tomorrow to actually get it done. But yeah, but that means you guys have to get back here. Sure, or to the other. Yep. All right. <clears throat> Signs and omens. You recognize many constellations in the night sky. The Ooh. Twin Warriors. The Seal and her Cub. Oh, the Wench and also the cup, which is said to have appeared in the heavens when Arthur claimed the grail. Now it seems that one of the stars on its edge is turned red, as if the cup was leaking blood. What foul omen is this? Your time is running out. The next travel of every character costs one less. So one energy less for every travel that you do, for any travels. That works oh, for you guys. Place one additional random event on top of the event deck. Oh, okay. Well, it says the next. Is it just the next one or all? Just the next one. Okay. So, then discard this card. That's still helpful. So is that other event still out there? The unnatural chill? Uh, no, that goes away. Okay. Yeah. I think you can get this. Yeah. Just put it on the back bottom. So for me, you'd move there. It only cost one. Yes, one total between the two of us. Yes. Well, do you want to do that? More than likely, yeah. It's yeah, only the first movement? Yeah, let's do it as a party because then we face that gray together. All right, so we're going to face a gray encounter right. together. You all, you all I have four, four. You have what? Four. Four. I'll lose the one. Okay. I have no problem. With it. It's a crazed farmhand. Uh, so right. question, is it just your first move? Like I could do something else and then my first move is free? Uh, no, yeah, yeah. You could do whatever. Yeah, it's whatever your first move is. Oh, yes. wait. Yep. It was this one yep. over here. It, it is whatever your first move is. 
Wouldn't it cost you zero then? The next travel of every character costs one it less? It costs us one to three characters. Oh, right, yeah, right, 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 right. Okay. That's why. Yeah. Well, Latida. Yeah. Let's see. Uh, Kyle says, oh, hey, Matt. It's hard not mm -hmm. to lose your mind when the world seems to have gone insane. Thanks for uh, subbing, Kyle. Um, that one's not bad. It only takes four. Four to kill. Um, rush, though. First character receives two, so whoever goes first takes two damage. I guess I'm going to go first, because we don't want you to take two damage. So I will just automatically go first. Let me look at what I can do here. I appreciate that, Steve. We're a team player. Um, this looks like Joe's character after he gets his hands on so some things he shouldn't. Mm -hmm. That is me. Yeah, You're fighting me. Why did Joe appear? Ah. Does that what you sound like? You got any mushrooms? <laughs> I'm yeah, I was hungry. gonna say if these games go this long, we might have to cut them in halves. Yeah. Yeah. Um, I'd say we just call it at eleven or whatever, you know. I'm gonna. I was gonna try to call it at ten thirty, but it's already there. Yeah. It's going forward. We didn't get started till like after eight tonight, though, either. Because we all work in the morning. Oh, because we were. Figuring out well characters and whatnot, and then we had no sound and whatnot. Yeah, we had to restart again. Yeah, this is pretty simple though. I think the combat was the most difficult part, but the rest of the game is right. pretty easy oh, to understand. This. Move, spend. Which lets me do one, lose, two, lose everything. three damage. Very nice. Skeet, um, skeet. So are you gonna? Or shield, are you gonna go over here and like explore? And sure. Then... Or do you want to try to do food with me? I don't want you wasting energy yeah. to so just try for food, you know oh, what no, I mean? Right. <laughs> but you're going to need right. food so three. the next, next round, you know what I mean? Um, three. Right. Oh, so, I take so it's two, a constant one, two, battle where I'm going to need some tonight. One, right. two, two, more. And then it loses one. And it loses one. Dang. Yeah. I'll definitely fight next. Or I just use a bunch of actions to yeah. go to zero and don't gain yeah. food, you know what I mean? <laughs> because if I'm at, if it just takes you down to zero, I just lose one health anyways. Yeah. But then I lose another health for whatever time you're exhausted. Because of, yeah, so yeah. I lose two health. Yeah. But so I would gain two more. a health I technically know. the next round if I have food again. This is the only one with damage, and I can't play a second. And it wouldn't do any damage on that card. <laughs> no, it won't. <laughs> This will let me draw you, a card. You could have you could have mulliganed two though. Yeah, let me mulligan this one. Yeah. Get down to two. Uh, no, you discard the their mulligan is you would have just discarded those and drawn the two others. It's not technically. Oh, uh, it's a, yeah. it's a okay. It's yeah, a better it's, version actually then. Yeah, it's it's technically that. That's fine. Don't worry about it. Just just draw just just draw two. It doesn't matter. Okay. You know, just jump out and draw two. It's not gonna kill her either way. Could be. Again, it doesn't matter what it starts with, so it's really just how it connects. I can't play the metric children. Because it won't let you draw a card? At the end. Well, not technically. It'll, it'll be the start of my turn. Right, but that'll actually let me... Well, oh, no, hold on. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, because that one does it. And that's really bad. You can, can you combo that one? You can't combo that one. Oh. Okay, yep, no. Um, well, you could also... Uh, play... It, it doesn't necessarily... Play the... Play that one. Why don't lose damage? I don't want to do that. Oh, hey. Oh, I guess not. All right, then I guess play the other one. I, I do understand that. Yeah, it's, it'll but, make him do one more damage. <laughs> it's better not to play anything. Is that an option? It is, except but then he gets his opportunity attack, and which means he runs away. Then he goes away. Does that matter? Well, we just wouldn't get the extra loot from him, but it's fine. That's one food. I'd rather just have him run away. Okay, that's fine. Yeah. All right. All right. Run away! So, okay. what, so what would you like to do, Joe? Um, you want to move and explore? Yeah, I might move. 
so it's free for me to move. I'm, I'm, I'll probably just move with you. Okay, you want to do that? Yeah. Okay. This is I mean, how nothing, we do I mean, it. nothing happens. All right, back to you guys. All right. Then we can explore together or whatever. You move down, Steve? We can do yeah, the treasure hunt together. Yeah, I would think we should. Oh, which what gains us one tear right, that puts me down to one two wealth. by using that one. And okay. then we roll a die, and if the result is right. six, so we'll we go to verse four. Is there anything automatic? No. Nope. nope. Right. You can heal there for one wealth. Yeah, yeah. but that's an right. future thing, so go ahead. You want to explore like first? Yeah, let's explore. One in each. 106. Is it a menu on the back? That's pretty cool. Four Dweller Mounds. If you have the Winds of Weirdness, we don't have that, do we? Nope. Yeah, a lot of things want that. Read on. It's not good, I think, is why it would. The mist-covered mounds resonate with the sound of spades and pickaxes. Once only insane treasure hunters worked here, but as more and more gold emerged from under the earth, these burial grounds turn into a regular mine. Or at least, almost regular. People still disappear and go mad here on occasion. Do we wander deep into the mounds or chat with the miners? That's up to you, Joe. Why me? I don't know. I mean, I'm down to just wander. Yeah, you are. <laughs> <laughs> Have you been shopping with this man before? Yeah, that's and how you, you find your and mushrooms. You don't like to talk to people. <laughs> what? <laughs> I just have a short temper. Yeah. He steals things. He prefers to smack people. I had to fart. That was my thinking cap. Okay. Fine, I gave you the option, so... This is your wandering. Uh, go to verse one. No one was ever able to count the mounds, and the most experienced miners claim new ones keep arriving, though no one can explain how. How far do you dare to wander? Stick to the places where other miners work? Go just beyond the currently explored part? Pay one green Energy. per party member? Roll a die, add plus one for each point of your bore. Walk and don't stop until you find something interesting. Pay two per party member. Roll a die, add two for each point of your bore. So how much bore do you guys have together? Well, I have, I have one, two. So we have, you have one bore. No, I have two. That's bear. Oh, bore is this Boar's one? courage, yeah. Oh. What do you think? I think that's a lot of energy that we need to Get food and do other things, and we need wealth and crap to get these menus up. We can spend one each. Which is which? Go just beyond the currently explored Sure, part. let's yeah. be dumb. Alright, roll a d6. You roll a d6. Uh, you don't want me to roll. No, you don't want me to roll. As, so it's as, plus two. As Jay. Yeah. Jay, no, yeah. He does like this. Right, and then, Luke and then it, it should come out as limp as possible. Yeah. Well, that was terrible. So Four? Should have rolled. Four. Uh, check your result in verse eight. Eight. Four. The die, this was in my way. It would have been an eight. <laughs> uh, the thick mist surrounds you while morning song in an unknown language pierces your mind. Cool. Each party member gains one terror. Exploration ends. Cool. Oh. Well, what would have been a better number, Joe? Oh, any of them. <laughs> yeah, any of them, really. <laughs> it depends. They all do. Some of them make you lose health. Some of them make you read other verses. I don't know. Yeah. Really. Exactly. But I don't know what number does what. So. All right, so that was your guys' explore of that yep. area. Yep. So are we going to explore this area, then? Yeah. Okay. 109. So how, how, many, how much do you have two left? Yeah. I'm at two as well, so do you want to use your both of yours or one of yours to do that? Darn, John, that's Whatever gonna. Whatever you think is best. Mm, okay. Um, you you have wealth, right? I do have wealth. So you could potentially get what are you doing? back if you wanted. I could. And that well, I'm be just nice. thinking. I can't get back, and okay, I can I move us back. Food, but I already have food, I'd be so exhausted again, but that's fine that for me. Oh, yeah. I can pay to move us right, back, folks. Nice. But you wouldn't right. be able to go on the food right, adventure, would you? We're exploring, Joe. Okay. Uh, the waves splash against the hull of a boat. A silent hooded man slowly ferries you to a secluded island. It's dark willow grove overlooked on three sides by an ancient necropolis carved into the side of the mountain. You know the sick are kept in deep dark holds, yet you still feel uneasy stepping down onto the shore. 
Grim monks, the keepers of this place, inspect your body despite your objections. Only then do they agree to listen to you. <clears throat> we don't have secret 66, but if we have tracker status and a dial representing the bow maiden, go to verse 11. Hey! How dare you bring her here? Verse 11 is a secret. Oh, gosh. One. Four. Four. Wait, what? Four. <laughs> three. Seven. One four seven. Seven. Just for it makes no sense. <laughs> that could be. <coughs> Book of Secrets, secrets. dog. One four seven. Bow Maiden reluctantly thanks you and hands you a small parting gift. Each party member gains one experience. Yeah. That's what we needed. Gain secret card seventeen. Uh, you have them over there. Card 17, go ahead. Discard the dial and exploration ends. Let's see if 17 was worth it. It's the Stag Father's Charm. Stag Father's Charm. <laughs> when you draw the bowl counter, put it back at the bottom of the deck. Gain one food and continue the game. Oh, that's nice. That's going to be. That's technically. One of yours. One of us. Okay. And, then it, and then when we get to that point where we can choose secrets, that would be a secret that we had or didn't. Well, okay, now what? Uh, so we can do a free action. Right? Oh, to the, the menu. Yeah, so now it's... Yeah, we should... Sh well, that's, it's new round now, yeah. so... Mm -hmm. okay. We inspect it for free. Yep. We so can both do it together. Uh -huh. Yeah. 106. Yeah. Minier requires all characters, and the menu writes secret card. One energy, one health, two wealth, and one food per player. You said two food? No, one food per player. Two wealth, one food. It's not as bad if we can get a bunch of wealth somehow. Yeah, okay. Well, well, those two are next to each other. Pay one trade. food and gain one wealth here. Yeah. We would need eight, eight, eight wealth, though. Yeah. I have two. Where the other one is one health, one wealth, one magic. But three energy. Right. Right. So it takes more energy, but... Well, that would need so How much so magic do we need? We would need a total five. of five. Because oh. of Matt's ability. Right. And we what only do, have but four. But you have the ability to make a magic each... Turn, right? Up to a maximum four. Right, Can't so. get us to five. Right. Right. I changed how I'm writing. I'm doing one E, one H, okay. one W, one F. All right. Makes more sense in my brain. So me and Matt, or me and Josh are done then for this round. Uh, Figure it's good to. I have zero energy, so I have to pass. I have one. Um, give me one second. Mm. The menu okay. becomes uh, empty this night, this morning. Goes to one. No, it's on one. It goes to zero. It stays there for the re next turn. Yep. And then we're dead. Nah, probably things happen. Dead. Nah. Dead. Probably an hour, another hour's worth um. of playing. I don't want to do. Yeah. You know, maybe I. You know what? I. I. I don't think I'm gonna spend the one because the night because I can actually go up to five actual yeah. energy for the next round. So, okay. Yeah. So. You passing? Yeah. So I'm passing as well. Okay. Okay. Josh, I'll pay to move us to energy. Okay. You're a madman, but okay. Yep. I think this is probably the one to do. Hmm. Unless we can get magic somehow. I think I could get it. Jo Josh, remind me. I think I can get one from the charred conclave. Okay, so you're gonna gather food. Yeah, I'm gonna do gather food. So which you get is two, two food, and you get a green encounter. It is a pack of strays. Yay. Horde. During step three, the active character discards two combat cards from the top of their combat deck. If you ever, if your combat deck ever runs out, then then you die. You lose the combat. You die. Cool. Uh, you only need five, though, to kill it. Cool. One shot it. I don't know if that's possible, but okay. One shot it. One shot it. One shot it. 
I'm going to pass, by the way. So. Great, I have no green flags to help me here. Green flags? To... Play more than one card? Play more than one. The gold ones, yeah. What are these things? So that's what happens at the end of the round if that's the last card you end on. So when it does di when it does its response, it'll do one extra compared to what it would normally do. But on the future turn, when you start up again, you get to draw an extra card. Mm. Gotcha. And this is gain a card. I can't see. Uh, yep, that would be gain a card. So if that one lines up, that might be a good one to start. But... Yeah, I think I'm going to do that one. Okay. Right. So and then do one. one. Yep. yep. Draw a card. You need to draw a card immediately. Come on, something good. And then. Well, don't you do that immediately too? The take a dial. Yeah, you have to toss the dial, which is. Mm. Could be bad. Could yeah. be good. Come on, Grail. Ouch. Skull. So you gain two damage. So you take two damage. Awesome. I'm not liking this. Cool. 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 Or no, is it if he attacks? No. It's just it's uh, that's th that's an automatic that happens immediately. Mm, okay. <clears throat> what does it mean if you escape? That means if you end on that card and you choose to escape, then that's, that effect happens. That says, that's what that symbol There's is, right? Relatively little. So reason it, it says plus escape, two. It doesn't say two damage. damage. You don't yeah, have crap for attack. cards, man. Be plus two. Plus two. What do you have as yeah. far as golds? Nothing, Nothing right now. I mean, no, these golds. Any of these, anything. So that one you could play. Yeah, but that doesn't do anything. It's for escape. It literally yeah, is. Cool. Just oh no! Yeah, skull. Right. His attack will be Well, the damage. only bonus okay. of having it's fine. the He'll only bonus of having this down would be yeah, you would have more yeah. things to play off on a future turn. But obviously, that doesn't change a lot. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> so you might want to just stop mm -hmm. your round there. Yep. Nothing else will happen. So yep. then So you've done one. You'll take one more damage. Yep. Then I draw a card. Draw a card. Yep. Because you're. Cool. So this is where having this one out would have helped. Potentially. Well, you can put anything down now because it's the start of your new round. Gotcha. So you can put anything down now as your starting card. Oh. If you can combo off of it, it's worth more. So, so he ended his first one? Mm -hmm. He did. He should have one more damage then. Why? Zero to one is one damage plus two. That's three. He took two. He no, was he, was at, he was up at nine. He goes all the way up for health. Yeah. He's at the top right, he still took two, though. I took three. I'm Did down to six. Yeah, he was on six. That's the stop. Okay. One, two, three. Yeah, that's where he was at. So I can do this. You can play anything off of this. It gives you two yeah. damage. So that, yep, that'll do two damage there, yep. But I take a damage, right? Right yep. away? No, well, you don't take any damage. That's only if it responds. If you end there, it doesn't respond. I don't think spots. he has doubles of this, does he? Okay. You're yeah, not, he does have double bear. You're yep. not ending, so. And then I can do this, right? Which has yep. this connection. Three yeah. And do three more, yeah, and, then that's that, and then that's yep. the six. What do you get? One food? Yep. One food. All right, there's your food. And it's yep. dead. You don't get any experience or anything off of them? That's kind of sad. That's what it says. Heard a bunch, but also got food. Right. So, which one are we trying to focus on here, guys, to try to do? All right. Let's. Are you passing or are you? Yeah, I'm gonna okay. pass. All right. So we're all passing. So we go to the end of the day. Let's do that. Rest. Everyone must consume a food. Uh huh. Uh, restore one hit point. Uh huh. Lose one terror. Uh huh. Restore your stuff. Uh huh. Spend experience. Yeah. Do we have any wealth? Do we have enough to That's two wealth. Okay. I think we're sadly going to have to do the the three energy one for the magic. We're going to need to get that five magic, though. Yeah, because I only have one wealth. So what they could do is when they come up, they could do it, couldn't they? And just listen? Or was it a thing just for your character? Uh, I think it said if I was in the party. I'm just thinking, they're going to be moving up, you're going to be moving down. Right. And I need to gain another magic before I do that anyways. Because I can't do that after... If I gain the fourth magic, I can't use my ability. 
Mm, gotcha, so you have to do that before you go down there. Yeah. Which is going to take two. Mm -hmm. Plus one movement. Mm -hmm. Which takes, well, two movement, which takes mm -hmm. you to zero, right? Mm -hmm. Just to get there. Mm -hmm. mm. So we're going to start a day. Remove the expired miniers. There's none of those. Reduce all time and miniere dials. Uh, reveal well. the next event card. Pay the food and do uh -huh, all that stuff uh -huh. too. I didn't that stuff. Good weather. Your first travel today cost one less movement. <clears throat> experienced journeymen know how to make the most of decent weather while it lasts. Well, that's very good. All movement oh, as well. I, had experience. Just the first. I could actually do a thing. Yeah, yeah, do that. Um, yeah. So. Boom, shakalaka. Okay, okay. Which one did you do? The top one? No, the bottom. I put one in spirituality because gotcha. I had one there. Yep, which, yep. That was the only way I could do that. I'm going. No, I don't have enough anymore. <laughs> I will do nothing. All right. So now what do we do? This is our last turn. Not necessarily. Are we at zero right now? Yeah. Yeah. Um. We don't have enough magic. And we don't have how enough. How much magic do we need? Five. Five because of that. Yeah. Or we need four wealth. No. I have two. And we need four wealth, right? Or no, it would be eight wealth, sorry. Yeah, we need eight wealth for the other one. Or four wealth for this. Because right now it's... For this one, it is uh, one health. So four health, four wealth, five magic. Four health, four wealth. Plus four 12 wealth. energy, though. Yeah. So if we got the resources to enter a turn, we can do it at the beginning of the next. We don't give it at the beginning of the next Well... Turn. We don't know what will happen with the thing because of the way that, because of that being the base thing, it, I don't know that it necessarily destroys all the stuff around it because it's the first one. Mm. There's, I think, some special rules when it comes to the main, the, the only men. I think it did part. say that, yeah. Yeah, there was something it about was in that the all locations somewhere, yeah. go away. You um, just take damage unless you're at this location with it or something like that. Right. Um, yeah. I'll double check that. Um, but... Yeah, we're, in, we're in a so we we're so, nowhere near the wealth because it's eight wealth. We're more close to getting the magic. What is it for? Just a second ago. Four for this one, but eight then we also need five magic. Eight for this. Eight for yeah, that we one. We need to get the magic. We but this doesn't need as much. This doesn't need magic, magic at, all. at all. Right. I mean, we're closer to the magic. If, if Steve or I can somehow get magic from this event, you can only get it if Joe is there with you. I, that might not be true, but. I, mean, I think it was. That took us down a different path every time because I was there Correct. as soon as we started the It'll exploration. So they can move, I can do the magic thing, and then they can explore first and see what happens, I guess. Yeah. Do you want to move together, both of us? Uh, so then we can do the blue thing? The blue thing. Because we're going to have to end up here anyways. And it'll be a blue encounter. And it'll be a blue encounter. Oh, sure. Yeah, we can do that. Do you want food before you move? That's fine. I can give him a food. I can lose a hit point. Yeah, he's got the two. very worst. We don't need food then for this one. Okay. Oh yeah, Josh does have a spare food. Okay. Uh, yeah, uh, it's one energy, one health. No, it's three nope. Energy. That's the other one. It's three energy, one health, one wealth. Which I'm gonna have any energy. Yeah, we're, we're not gonna be able to actually pull it off until tomorrow. I mean, it's like. No matter what, we're going to be a night over. So we need five magic and four wealth and a bunch of energy. Mm hmm. Okay, how much wealth do we have? Four. Okay. So nobody can spend any wealth. Yep. Correct. And we need two more magic. Mm hmm. So why don't you guys move first? Me and Josh will move. Or we, can, or we can move and then yeah, you guys right. can move. Let's go move here for free. Okay, you got to do gray. You got to do your gray. It is a wandering priestess. She believes ancient customs will protect her on the trail. You know it's only a matter of time before she's proven wrong. Each party may decide to pay one wealth, one food, or one food to gain three health. Oh, not, not That's it? Yeah. It's just, uh, yeah, just an encounter. Well, I can't uh, spend any wealth to gain anything. Nope. What is it? You may pay a wealth or a food to gain three health. But we need all the wealth we have currently to... Plus, we need... Yeah. Three. Okay. Um, so no. So, uh, if we move, um, we move. Yep. 
Okay, blue encounter. If the last menu on the map goes out, do not remove the last remaining location cards. Good, yeah. The characters may continue to, pay, to play in these locations, but they lose two health and two and gain two terror at each start of day. Okay. So we technically uh, until they do. So technically, we'll have the end of this one. We will go to the. Um, we'll roll through again, and then that's actually when we would start. Mm. Because, like, not until the following one, because we wouldn't be at the start. We'd already be at the start of the day before. At the beginning of the start of the day, it said we'd take it just, that? It says at start of day. Okay. And it doesn't say in here that. It doesn't, yeah. You know, when you'd actually take your damage. So. Call him before the storm. Nothing happens. Place this card at the bottom of the balloon counter deck. Wow. Is this considered a settlement? Yes. Okay. Yes. All right. Because we're not going to do anything else, correct? I'm going to get my magic. Yeah, but I mean... Maybe we can explore. I don't know if there's anything worth exploring here there, anymore. There are other things you guys didn't take. You so, could ask for help. Maybe there's something that they... You know, because oh, remember yeah. in the exploration, there was ask the townsfolk for help or whatever. Yeah. So maybe that oh. would be helpful. I don't know. That was this one. So you guys exploring? The, this one also had a okay. thing about mm -hmm. asking about being helpful. Or I could craft an item. Yeah. You could. Yeah. Do I don't it. know if that's helpful. Yeah, you can do it. So I'm going to yep. spend two to get my magic. Okay. So I'm up to four magic. Okay. I don't have any points. I'm just gonna suck, but okay. Yeah, you just go down to zero stamina. So if, oh, as long as you're not we at zero. We went into this spot. We should have drawn a great. You did. We already yeah. did. Okay. Nothing okay. happened. Or that was that the one you have to spend. You could give a wealth or, or a food to get three health back. Okay, that's yep. fine. That was your encounter. Okay. Uh, so what are we doing? We exploring that space to see if we can get the magic? Is that what we were trying to do? Yeah. The idea? I think so. Yeah. All right. Well, then let's try that. One oh four. Yep. No 4.5. I'd be like, sorry, you need Joe there. Uh, okay. It doesn't take long to find it. You just have to follow your nose. The remnants of an enormous wicker man kneel at the bottom of the small veil. Blah, 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 If you're playing Magnet, go to verse 10. Otherwise, choose one. Stay a while Stay a while and listen. Dig through the remains. Or leave while your sanity remains intact. I guess stay a while and listen is the only one that has the potential to Unless we found a magical item. Right. You know? But I'm good with either one. Uh, I would stay a while on this one. Uh, let's stay a while on this one. Okay. You stand there for a while, pondering whether this massacre was justified. The druids were blamed for the return of the Red Death, but without them, the plague kept on while the Meneers weakened. The whispers in the wind became louder on every minute. There's still some form of life left in the burnt out husk. You wonder what knowledge or madness they can bestow. You can learn from the Conclave and pay one green per person or leave. Yeah, I think so. Learn from the conclave. Going to verse 10. The lipless mouth sneer to you, at you. The melted fingers seem to beckon and call you. Angry whispers grow. Finally, you realize they want you to come inside. Uh, go inside. Requires maggot or at least one owl. One spirituality. I've got that. Put your ear to the bars and gather what you can from here. You're a party, so it just requires one so in the one party. Percent. Remember, the ear one is the way they gain that you gained magic from, but it might be different for them. Okay, well, what did you say? Go inside, or put your ear to the bars and gather what you can learn, or leave. Uh, so the ear one was the one that we gained. The ear one he gained one magic for in the very beginning. All right, well then we'll do the ear one. After a while, you learn to distinguish singular voices in the maddening cacophony of whispers. Several threaten you t or throw curses for what you, your kin have done to the druids. Some cry out in agonizing pain. One describes a secret invocation. If you have at least three magic, you don't. Uh, each party member gains one magic. Each party member who has at least one bird gains one insanity. One terror. Terror. Exploration ends. There you go. Now, oh, we, we, go. now we have enough magic. <laughs> whoop, whoop, whoop. We just need the stamina and stuff. I so. guess for my turn, I think I'm going to craft. Okay. So you get three crafted items? It says draw three random craftable items and pick one. Only in settlements. Oops, it was there. It's more than three. They're not crafted. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Ooh, Ooh, a shield. Give him a donkey. Son of a gun. There was also a piglet. I don't want an adventures kit again. That's really, that's not crafted? Masterwork armor. You're not a good crafter, that's why. No, the other smith could do it, but you already punched yeah. him in the teeth. Yeah, he's got no teeth now. Yeah. Thanks, Josh. 
And you know, I used to have teeth, but now I'm getting weak. You can't even make a sword? Oh, there you can make a rusty sword. You can't make a clan sword. Well, no, it's a clan sword. He's not part of a clan. I don't know. All right, so that's your turn. My turn. So pretty much the weapon is kind of like his thing. Is Here, you, 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 magic. you uh, go into combat, you gain an extra red thing, uh, you flip oh, the dial. Right. Right, yeah. If it's a skull, you discard it. If it's a grail, nothing happens. Okay. Whereas the shield is, if your sequence yeah. ends with a snake, you prevent one damage. Mm, that's not bad. That's not bad. That one makes more sense. And the other one is another adventurer's kit. Yeah, you can give items... Um, You're right, wealth I, or food to other people. I could give items. I'm just letting you know. <laughs> you know. Well, it's important. Sometimes it's important to be yeah, able yeah. to do that. You know? How much energy do we need, though? Or? Twelve. Three per person. So we won't be able to do it today. Correct. Should we move up into that spot? I was going to make myself food. That's two. Can yeah. Steve pay to move you both? Uh, yeah, I could. But then we only have enough energy tomorrow. I get. I have six. So I'll get four. Because I'll have food. Oh yeah, we'll all get at least four, yeah. no matter what. Okay, yeah. Well, you, I don't. I don't know if you do any. You don't have food. You still do. You just drop to zero first, you then you Josh go back up. Josh might be able to give me a food too. Yeah. yeah. I think it's worth the two for me to make. Is it an energy to give food? You good with that? That's fine. Mm, I think it's a free action if you're on the same spot to trade. Yeah. You can. You at can any time. To, yeah. There, no, there's a, there's a thing in here that just literally says as yeah. long as you're in the. Yeah, I can give you a food. Yay, I can eat. Do you want me to give you a food? Sorry, I've been so then I'll move staring at magic here, all day. Cost me the rest of my thing, and we have a blue encounter. Yep. It is a plague. <laughs> oh, what does that mean? Uh, it's yeah, a group of outcasts stricken with red death visit the settlement. All doors are shut. You got yes, a Kyle, I am ready for Saturday. Uh, okay, so it is, uh, yeah. Oh, you guys have those over there. All right. Uh, let's see. It's. Let's see. For so Lord, one magic, one map. <laughs> so we want. So, Joe, really, you can get rid of. If we can help it. Like, you can minimize uh, that because I'll you have it already that. over there. No. Okay. That's so. Facebook chat as well. That's multi stream chat. I thought you said you don't see it. Or you can't respond back. Yeah, see, Kyle. Ooh. Wow. Oh. Okay, so this one we have to do. Two, this is a two-step one, or, or it's a potential. So we either evade the infected or ask for shelter. So we can choose which we're doing. I believe diplomacy or um. Well, what we should have probably did, Joe, in the very beginning, is probably flip That's this one. Joe, has flipped this one and seen what it said when it's like, it gave us the three things. Mm. So we should have done originally. I do this on my own. Do it Do that. Yep. So one, two, three, four. <coughs> okay. uh, reward. One magic and one rep. No. 
that's stage one. You have well, to. It's just that or. It's just. It's, so got, it's got the. Work. The player has to complete stage one and then stage two in order to win. That, that these diplomacy cards have two stages. Okay, so the one that says or is two stages. If it says oh, or on it, I don't know. See, that says or right there instead of. The, the there might be ones that have one and two. I bet. Oh, yep, you're right. Yep, yep, yep. that's fine. Yep, yep. Yeah, they both say one. So, yeah. good call. Okay. Okay. Yep. You're okay. good. Defeated. Okay. So we get one magic and one reputation. I have two reputation. You have one reputation. What would you prefer to have? I'd rather take the rep. Okay. And I will take it as the magic. Magic. That'll be fine with me. Okay. Let's go back. There you go. They didn't even need to, to search for that magic. I know detail and evasiveness. All right. Got us out of the plague. Um. Okay. <clears throat> I guess should I explore or should I just end it? Because then I'll have more. We, you energy. might want to have it because I'm going to have very minimal energy and he's going to have very minimal okay. energy. Okay. Yep. I'll just pass. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Pass. Yeah. Okay. Pass. Mm -hmm. Pass. Okay. Right. End of ray. Consume one food. Okay. Consume the food. Gaining a piece. Dang, I'm at zero terror. One, Most two, three, the full health. four. Give yourself four or full. Yep. Uh, advance your character by spending experience. I don't have enough to um, advance. Do you want to advance? No, you guys don't have enough. I mean, well, I could buy a card, but... Yeah. Yeah, you guys have three. I don't know if that carries over. Uh, Cards? It, does, it, yeah. does. Oh, okay. it all carries. I'm going for six. Six? No. No, I'm not. I'm going for four. I want empathy. That way I'm the master. All right, are we ready to dream? Uh, I got a flip. Next thing? Yeah, I guess it is. Oh, yeah. Well. So we all dream. Your dream of home is understandable, considering the first time everyone's talking and walking backwards. Okay. So now, it's start of the day. Remove the expired miniatures and discard locations that are out of the miniature range. But okay. this one doesn't get removed. We'll just crash it. <laughs> well, it technically gets re it's removed. Oh, is it? But none of these go away. Right. This stays out because it's the last one that we had on the board. Reduce all time and to time tokens. Reveal the next event card. Get wrecked. That's what it says. Dying of the light. Check the Menher. If there's an active Menher in Connacht, put this card back on top of the event deck. Otherwise, read on. Oh, it's like it knows. The weirdness is coming. From now on, in accordance with the Menhers and weirdness section of the rulebook, you lose two health and gain two terror at the start of each day, including now, okay. until you're back in range of an active mentor. So we lose two health. Ouch. Two. That hurts. And gain two. So. That have won a lot. <clears throat> okay. Um, put this card back on top of the event deck. Okay. Alrighty. So. That's awful. Activate the mentor. <laughs> Well, yeah, how much how much energy do we have combined? I have four. I, I have four. Matt has four, so we're good. That's twelve right there. So, and Josh has some too. Six. Well, the reason why I'm asking is because if something is, did anybody want to do anything before we activate the mentor? Josh can make another item. We solve enough. Will no, it? it takes four for me to make an item. How much do you have? Six. Well, we all have four, so we four times three is okay. Twelve, right? So you want to craft another item? Or does anybody want to do any other thing that might be important? I don't need food, no. No? Well, we don't know what's going to happen after you we have, do is, this. Does anybody have anything that reduces terror might, on anybody? That does, this doesn't mean it's going to end. Yeah, this, this right? doesn't mean it's going to end. We no. might want to do this and then see what happens. True. I think that's not a bad idea. Sure. Nobody has anything that reduces insanity for cheap, do they? Mm -hmm. I have nothing that reduces insanity. Nope. I'm at two. I don't know. Oh, did we go up by two because of the thing? Yeah. But, okay. Okay. We went up. Oh, and you're insane. That's why. We yeah. went up in in, in insanity. Uh, yeah, you go up two. You took two damage and went up two insanity. Oh, I didn't hear the two insanity thing. Terror. Every turn that's going to happen. Every cool. start of day now. So. Read all out, fool. You are going insane. Yep. Out of all dangers on this island, the creepy madness <laughs> is the most insidious. Attach this card to your character tray whenever your terror marker is in the red section of the terror track. <clears throat> your rest no longer restores any health. You have no dreams, only nightmares. Whenever you travel or explore, toss a dial. If you spend a skull, you lose one and continue your action, one energy. 
If you have zero, you lose one health instead. Grail, nothing happens, continue your action. So now every, me doing that is going to be after all the way along. Great. Okay. Alright, so, so... So revealing the men here then? Yeah, mm -hmm. let's do it. Okay. So we need... One health. No, four health. Four health. Four wealth. Four wealth. So, so here's one wealth. Two wealth. And then Steve had two wealth. Too, right? We're going to need to because when we move Dump down. Two wealth, Steve. Well, well, you spend it all at the same time, right? Uh huh. But here's the thing when you move down, you also move the, you, the yeah. appropriate block down. So that means that I'm going to have three energy to give. No, what, well, can't you give energy? Use the same energy time? first. I. Yeah, I, I don't suppose. Know. Yeah. It says energy yeah. is the first thing. Yeah. I'll spend three. Do you want me to spend three? Yeah. yeah. Yep, I'll spend three. Unless we just. Oh, yeah. I'll give a health. Yeah, no, we'll spend the three. We'll do that first, then, yeah. Yep, and then all give a health. Give one health yep. each, right? Yep, and I have. Who's got and, magics? And I gave the wealth, and I've got a magic. I've got, magic. I've got okay. two. All I've right. got one. Does anybody else have. You only have one? Yeah. I okay, have how zero. many do you have? Four. Four. We need to spend five. I can so. give three. I'd like to keep one, I guess. Okay. Okay. Okay, we put a menu out then. Uh, yeah. Well, it could be the same one that we just pulled, or it can be a different one. It's up to you which, what you want to do. Put the same one out, that's fine. And then read the success thing. Yep. That's two five. Um, there's not a thing for the men here in there? No? It, I mean, it, it just, that's all it says. Okay. Here. Okay. No, 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 I didn't know if it said anything else. No. Yeah. Okay, uh, when you activate one of these menhirs, uh, resolve the Chapter 1, Part 6 card from the event deck and discard this card. And congratulations! You've completed your first chapter of the Fall of Avalon campaign. Huzzah! Should we have done these first? No. Uh, well, technically, it'll yes, that's fine. They can, those can come out, yes. 114 and 117. But technically, these others are going to fall away, too. At the beginning of next turn, yeah. Each character gains two experience and one magic. Nice. Each character gains one free combat deck advancement to the character advancement hmm. section of the rule book. From combat deck, not the right. So, so if you look at your combat deck, uh -huh. you you'll draw three, three and then pick one of the three that you drew. Oops, I never shuffled this. And then you have to take out shuffled. one also out of your main deck. No, you no, don't no, have no. to. You add you it can to your main you want. deck. You can take it out, but add it for now, and then you can minimum of fifteen, I think. Yeah, right. you have a minimum of fifteen. So it's up to you if you want to call it that. Gotcha. Later on, it might be better to have a bigger deck because if they're long combats or something. They might. No. Why? Pass. Can't use this one. That one's pretty garbage. Oh, that one's really good. I'll take that one. Wow, that is really good. Okay. Yep, take that one. Easy choice. One that lets me use my magic to do insane amounts of damage. So. No job. There's a random that goes back. Heroic strike. It's, it's probably the best one. Four damage. Nice. Yeah, that's pretty nice. nice. And then you also gain in damage for each boar, too. Yeah, yeah. Mine's, uh... Nice, because it... Mm -hmm. Out of the ones I chose. And then, also, it prevents two damage. And lets somebody draw a card. That one's interesting. Retribution. You gain uh, damage for each missing heart. <laughs> more, yeah, miss, miss more than health on you, yeah. Hmm. That's awesome. That's kind of cool. Magic, that's like, real yeah. cool. Yeah, that's real cool. None of these are great, actually. What's interesting is well, when you get the times two in there, and it's times two plus two, then it's, yeah, it's four. four. Yeah, yeah. That's wild. I'm going to add this one, though. Heroic Strike makes the most sense to me. This one is you don't have to have the connector, and you can pay uh, magic or health to just add it for free without oh, the connector. Cool. All right, so then uh, discard your event deck. Place any discarded random event cards back in the random event deck and shuffle the random event deck. Okay. And then either save your game or draw a chapter two setup card 
and follow its instructions to begin the next chapter. Save game. Okay. So we're saving game, which we can yep. do that off the stream if we want to. Yeah, I can come back down. I know everyone wants to go, so. Cool. Um, um, the only thing I have, I guess I can read through the save game afterwards, but I'm just will, wondering if all these go away that aren't connected this now. One will that stay. one would stay, but the yeah. rest the will rest go away. The rest of them, this one as well. Yep. Those should all go away, yeah. Okay. Yep, those will go away as far as we're concerned, because they would have gone away at the start of the next thing. So that means the problem is going back there to get that one is real hard. Yep. Yeah. Yep. Okay. Cool. So, well, that was our first playthrough of Tainted Grail. Okay, so quickly, we do this every time. What do we think? Yeah. I like it. It's really long. It is. It is a bit long. It will get faster, but it will also continue to probably be close to this time. Yeah. Like, probably relatively close. We you just know? need to make sure to start at... Right, we need to make yeah. sure this is the one we Seven thirty, like yeah, we exactly. start on time yep. as best as possible. Yep. So I have it all ready have it set here. up. Yep. I can have it set up ready to go. That that will be a big deal. Yeah. yeah. That will be a big deal. What do you think, Joe? I really like this. Yep. Um, combat can be a little slow, but I think that's because we're learning. I think it's gonna get much faster yeah. as we get into it. Yeah. Yeah. Um, it is but, and I feel like tactical combat though too, so yeah. it may still end up taking a little bit of time, but it's gonna get cooler. And I feel like when if they're doing combat, we could really just take our turn and do whatever guys, we could. That is technically something we did. The only negative yeah, of that, is, that is that what if the result of our combat is something crazy and you guys needed to come and help us, then afterwards you would, you know like, like yeah. that would be the only difference. But yeah. Yes, you're you're very much correct. If you're not doing anything exciting. Then yeah, like if we're like happen. we're moving here or we're moving towards them yeah, or. Or we're going to search here, because that was a plan anyways. Right. Um, Matt, what do you think? Uh, Josh says, I like it, but it's really long, but we're also playing on a night when I have to get up early in the morning. Yep, Yay. yep, I, yep. Yep, yep, me too. Um, I think it's excellent. I liked it the first this, time. And, uh, I love the story. And, and I think yeah, cool. I like that and, it's super... And without any spoiler whatsoever, we opened the other men her that we didn't open really? in the other campaign, so we were already on course for something oh, entirely cool. different than what I did. That's great. Any other yeah. Did you guys have the men or fall in yours or no? Uh, the first one. Not before. Not before we got to the second one, but literally right in. It's like right that after turn. We started the next, yeah. like the turn after we started the next one. That yeah, yeah. Yeah. So, so I'll go through the save off stream. You guys don't care about that anyways, and um, yeah, it's write a everything cool down. System. And you should mention what you think of it once you do. Yeah. Once you do it, because it's I will. super fast. And it, and it says once you're done saving, it says. To set up the next game, reverse these steps. <laughs> I was like, yeah, cool. <laughs> and then you just... Do you reset like, your health and everything to the no, same? No. No. Nope. Nope. Where we're at is where we're at. Yeah. That's, that's why, that's why I said... What you, be careful what you're feeling because there are things to do. So, yeah, what yep. are you doing, Matt? Matt! He's, he's doing whatever he's going to do. He's just going to make you paper if you need it. No. Make you buy it. The whole copy of the game. Alright, anyways, uh, we're going to end our stream for tonight. Yes. Good night. Um, until next time, my name is Joe. Matt. Steve. Josh. And you've been watching Down the Vet. Good night. <laughs>